What's up guys, this is your favorite fanfic YouTuber, the fanfic majesty, and welcome to another amazing video. You can follow me on Patreon for exclusive stories. 6 Shish, Chapter 151 It's time to see your old friend for the last time, Part 3 Please subscribe. Carl Uncle, the allied forces of the four villages have entered the border of the Land of Fire. Maybe they sensed that something was wrong with Carl. Even though Serutobi Hiruzen and others were worried about the impending war, no one dared to climb the Hokage Rock during these two days. Tsunade did not board the Hokage Rock until the reconnaissance team composed of Aburame Jue, Hayuga Hazashi and others who had been paying close attention to the allied forces of the four villages at the border of the fire country sent back news that the allied forces of the four villages had arrived. Come yet, Carl, who was lying on the Hokage Rock, heard the words, and the complexity in his eyes gradually receded. They're heading for the Valley of the End. However, no information on Uchiha Madara was found. Perhaps, he was hiding in the coalition forces of the four villages. Quote. Tsunade knew that what Carl asked was not the allied forces of four villages, but Uchiha Madara. With his strength, if you don't want to be found by you, it's impossible for you to even get a clue. Carl smiled, then got up from the Hokage Rock, and patted the dust off his clothes. Let's go, it's time to see old friends for the last time. His tone was very calm, and he no longer had the sentimentality that he had shown from time to time in the past two days. And many more, Tsunade stopped Carl, and took out a scroll from the ninja bag. Pop. As the white mist rose, a wide cape with a style different from ninja clothing fell into Tsunade's hands. It's been a long time since I wore this cloak. I didn't expect you, Xiao Gang, to find it. Quote. Carl was slightly taken aback when he saw this familiar but unfamiliar cloak. After the last battle with Senju Hashirama, after retiring to Konoha Haushan, he didn't cross it again. Never thought that Tsunade would come to him with this cloak. Since it's the last time I'm going to see an old friend, I should dress more appropriately. Otherwise, he may say you are rude. I think he has made such a mess of things, and he should be dressed very formally today. Backquote. After coming out of the Hokage Cemetery, Tsunade had a better understanding of Carl. She said with a light smile while putting the cloak in her hand on Carl. Yes, Carl stood still, letting Tsunade straighten his clothes. Of course, Tsunade withdrew his hands, took a step back, looked Carl up and down, and nodded in satisfaction. Let's go. Carl took a look at Tsunade, didn't say much, but stepped out with a single step, whipped up a gust of wind, and disappeared on the Hokage rock like teleporting. How do you know how to wear a cloak? After Carl left, Uzumaki Kashina, who was a bit late, looked depressed. How come I am behind Tsunade again? There is no reason. Everyone is from the ninja village era, you are Senju, and I am Uzumaki, why do you know more than me? Opportunities are only reserved for those who are prepared. Tsunade glanced at Uzumaki Kashina with a smile, then left without saying a word. TCH, she took the lead again. Uzumaki Kashina glared a little angrily at the place where Tsunade disappeared, and then chased after her. Valley of the End. Centered on the three towering stone statues towering above the Konoha forest, an army of nearly 10,000 Konoha shinobi led by Konoha F4, Sanin, and the patriarchs of the major ninja families directly surrounded the Valley of the End. 01021415 number 124,182,050. Just when Serutobi Hiruzen and others were waiting, Carl appeared on the stone statue of Uchiha Madara as if teleported, and appeared out of thin air in front of I who was still nailed to the stone statue at this time. Boy I, you seem to be in a good mood. Can you tell the old man to listen to it, so that the old man can be happy together? After all, it is rare for a dying person to smile so happily. Quote. Carl glanced at I who had been nailed to the stone statue for several days. Although his face was pale and his breath was weak, there was no gloomy look on his face. Quote. Dot. Quote. To witness the hero's defeat, or even the end of the curtain, of course I am happy. I couldn't help laughing when he saw Carl coming. Obviously, he also knows about the Four Shadows Alliance. What makes you so confident? Just the end of the crane at Madara. When Carl heard this, he suddenly felt amused. You, you know it. I's face changed slightly. He knew about Uchiha Madara, but before today, his memory was also sealed. Even if the Yamanaka family searched the memory, they would not know about Uchiha Madara. Until today, the seal in his brain will be automatically released. Yu Wang Zhao's will only be the son of Third Rakage, not the son of Onoki, Yi Kang, and Yugura. Third Rakage will go all out for you, so will the other three shadows. Apart from Hashirama, Madara is the only one who can make these shadows so brave. Quote. Carl looked at I with the eyes of a fool. You're still so confident. But so what if you know it's Uchiha Madara? There is one thing, at least the current you don't know, and this is also the biggest reason, you are destined to lose. In I's mind, the pair of eyes that looked down on everything like gods and looked down on everything appeared, and he immediately suppressed the shock in his heart. What about ninja heroes? Faced with eyes that only exist in myths and legends, you can only lose. Chapter 152 Uchiha Madara. Can you beat this man? The fourth update asks for subscription. Do you really think I don't know anything? Carl turned his head and stared straight into I's eyes, seeing this courageous future rakage with horror, he just turned his head and jumped onto the stone statue that belonged to him, obviously taller than Senju Hashirama and Uchiha Madara overhead. 
Pretentious. How could you? After Carl withdrew his gaze and turned to walk away, I took several breaths in succession to calm down the tension and anxiety in his heart. But thinking of Uchiha Madara's confidence, he immediately scolded in his heart. However, he was only halfway through the scolding, and his eyes glanced over where Carl was standing just now, and after seeing a pattern of rippling ripples there, the dark face suddenly changed. You, how is it possible? How does Iron Fist know so much? Wait, he said he watched Uchiha Madara leave. Could it be that he has been secretly observing Shira all these years without Uchiha Madara knowing? After a while, Ai Fang raised his head, but when he looked at Carl standing on top of the stone statue, his pupils and face were full of horror. When this kind of thought emerged from his mind, he, who had full confidence in this battle, the Four Shadows Alliance, and Uchiha 113 Madara, was shaken violently. Can Uchiha Madara, can beat this man? Allied forces of four villages. At this moment, Seekage, who initiated the four villages to form an alliance and commanded a coalition of 30,000 ninjas, respectfully surrounded a black-haired man. Although he is only one person, the sense of terror and oppression he exudes is the same as his attire, which is completely different from the four shadows and ninjas in the ninja village era. Wearing a red retro armor, Scarlet Three Tomo Sharingan, and that arrogant aura, not to mention the surrounding ninjas who dare not approach him, even when sighing surrounded him, he dared not take a breath. All because of his name. Uchiha Madara, Mr. Madara, the scouting team we sent out has reported that the Konoha Shinobi are basically stationed in the Valley of the End. Third Suchikage Onogi stepped forward and said in a loud voice. As the most senior cage of the contemporary five cages except Serutobi Hiruzen, he has a clearer understanding of Uchiha, BFBF, Madara and the strength of this man. Especially after this man showed the pair of legendary eyes that only exist in fairy tales, Onoki even had an idea. Although the four village coalition forces are huge, if Uchiha Madara thinks, even the four shadows plus 30,000 ninjas can't kill each other. Especially when third Rakage, Kei's cage Hakura, and Mizukage Yagura also said that they also felt this way during a private discussion with Seekage, Onoki became more certain that his view of Uchiha Madara was not an illusion. This ninja world can really kill all the allied forces of the four villages, including their four shadows, on their own. It is precisely because they clearly recognize that the gap between each other is so large that it cannot be bridged. Whether it is the deep-rooted Onoki of the city, or the grumpy temper, third Rakage's performance in front of Uchiha Madara can only be described in one word. Describe. All respect. Onoki, you should know that I'm not interested in Konoha Shinobi other than Hashirama and Senju Tobarama. Uchiha Madara crossed her arms, and the Scarlet Three Tomo Sharingan glanced slightly at Onogi. Just a look makes these third Suchikage who have witnessed the Sengoku era and the Ninja Village era feel like they are sitting on pins and needles. That man is here. Onoki took a deep breath, calmed down the panic in his heart, and then said in a deep voice. Although he didn't mention his name, but used that man to describe him, but after he said this, the expressions of the other three shadows suddenly became serious, and even their breathing suddenly stopped. Fangpo didn't even need to say his name, just thinking of that person's identity, sighing felt endless oppression and anxiety. Carl, Uchiha Madara's expression changed immediately. It was no longer the contemptuous arrogance of facing Onoki before, but a kind of uncontrollable excitement and excitement. At the same time, the surging fighting spirit and momentum spread among the coalition forces like a storm. Some ninjas within the range of Uchiha Madara's aura shrouded in momentum, one by one, their brains became blank, and their thinking seemed to be frozen directly. When these ninjas came back to their senses, they were all pale, with no blood visible, and their bodies were shaking uncontrollably. Mr. Madara, should we directly overwhelm the army, or? Fourth Mizukage Yagura was interrupted by Uchiha Madara before he could finish speaking. No hurry, call all the Jinchuriki. Uchiha Madara did not use the tone of discussion or inquiry, but directly ordered. When Yagura heard this, although he felt very uncomfortable, but thinking of dealing with Carl and relying on this man, and thinking of the eyes of this man, he immediately suppressed his anger and summoned all the Jinchuriki. One tail Jinchuriki Fenfu, two tails Jinchuriki Wooden Golem, three tails Jinchuriki Yagura, four tails Jinchuriki Old Z, five tails Jinchuriki Han, and two beast tail beasts. Six tails Saiken and seven tails Chome. As existence is second only to eight tails and nine tails, these two tailed beasts have not been sealed, and no Jinchuriki can control them. Two days ago, Uchiha Madara, who heard the news, left without saying a word for a long time. After returning, there were two more tailed beasts, six tails Saiken and seven tails Chome. After seeing the eyes of these two tailed beasts turned into Sharingan, the four shadows knew that they were dominated by Uchiha Madara's Sharingan pupil power. It was also Uchiha Madara's shot, understatement, forcibly controlling the will of the two tailed beasts with his terrifying pupil power, and it has continued until now. Tachibana Yagura, Third Rakage, and Hakura felt shuddering. Chapter 153, Shira of Ninja World. Master Madara, Jinchuriki and Tailed Beast are all here. Jinchuriki headed by Yagura and the two tailed beasts lined up in front of Uchiha Madara. Who can't be fully tailed? Uchiha Madara glanced over the group of Jinchuriki indifferently. Whenever the line of sight touches his Sharingan, which exudes ominous and evil pupil power, it is stronger than Mizuka Yagura, and Sunagakar's old brand Jinchuriki Fenfu, etc., all unconsciously avoid his eyes, and dare not eye to eye with him. Mr. Madara, don't worry, except for the six tails and seven tails that have not been sealed into Jinchuriki's body, every Jinchuriki here can not only completely transform into a tailed beast, but also skillfully use the abilities of tailed beasts, including tailed beast bomb. 
Onoki came out and explained. That's good, it saves me a shot. Although the tailed beasts are just the servants of the pupils, it is not difficult for me to control one or two more tailed beasts. Quote. Uchiha Madara heard the words, and said indifferently. But his words of treating Jinchuriki like ants made all the Jinchuriki present, including Shang Yagura, very angry. However, just when anger was rising in their hearts, they were swept away by Uchiha Madara's Sharingan, and they felt as if they had been hit hard in an instant. They staggered and took a few steps back. Don't have superfluous thoughts, and don't take yourself too seriously. It doesn't make any difference to me whether you exist or not. What I, Uchiha Madara, can do without anyone's help or consent, I keep you just so that there will be enough spectators on this stage to witness my first dance when Madara comes back. Seeing that no Jinchuriki dared to meet his gaze, Uchiha Madara withdrew his gaze in satisfaction. Regarding Di Yuanyu, although he is still dissatisfied with Di Yuanyu's ugly posture, after these days of continuous exploration, use, and use of Di Yuanyu to get some things from the four great ninja villages, he has repeatedly changed his view of Di Yuanyu. He even said bluntly in front of Black Zetsu that the treasure of Longyan village left on Kakuzu is really a pearl and dust. At this moment, he had only one opinion on Earth Resentment Yu, and there was nothing bad about it except being ugly. If you don't want to be an audience, and you're not interested in playing a supporting role to serve as a foil to my Madara, then I don't mind making this stage less embellished. Uchiha Madara paused every word, making Jinchuriki dare not stab again. At this time, let alone dare to be angry and dare not speak, even dare not be angry. Mr. Madara, you are too serious. If there is anything we need, you can just say it. Quote. Yagura took a deep breath and forced himself to calm down, showing his grovelling side. That's the right attitude, prepare the tailed beast bomb and launch it towards the valley of the end in one go. Now that Carl is ready, I, Madara, can't let him down. Seven tailed beast bombs are barely enough as a greeting after a long absence. Quote. A sneer flashed across Uchiha Madara's eyes. Four shadows. Once upon a time, the four shadows of the first generation level could dance with him. Although, the dancing time is not long, but at least it can be recognized by him. However, this generation of five shadows is not worth mentioning in his eyes. Wait, Mr. Madara, you can't do this. I is still at the valley of the end, once the tailed beast bomb is launched, given his physical condition, he will definitely not be able to hold on. Quote. When Third Rakage heard this, his expression changed immediately. Are you teaching me how to do things? Uchiha Madara looked haughtily at Third Rakage. No, it's just that you promised me that as long as I help you form an alliance of four shadows and an alliance of four villages, you will save I. The dignified ninja world Shira, is he going to go back on his word? Why is Third Rakage willing to be Uchiha Madara's pawn? In addition to Uchiha Madara's strength, and Rinnegan, there is also to rescue I. Ask for flowers, why did he go out of his way to help Uchiha Madara if his son was going to die anyway? I said this sentence, but you have such a good memory, you should also remember another sentence I said. You are not qualified to negotiate terms with me. If you choose to forget, that's okay, now I can tell you again. Rakage, calm down, Mr. Madara is planning to launch seven-tailed beast bombs to the valley of the end, yes, but it doesn't mean that I will die. Perhaps in Mr. Madara's view, detonating seven-tailed beast bombs is to ignite the flames of war, to send a signal to Iron Fist and Konoha. Mr. Madara is back, with the fourth ninja war coming. You want to go back on your word? Yes, Shadow. Come to think of it, Mr. Madara's target is Carl, not I. The seven-tailed beast bombs may seem terrifying, but in fact, for Mr. Madara and people like Iron Fist, they are equivalent to a firework. Uchiha Madara not only did not panic, but showed a hint of banter. Seems to be good too. Seeing that the war had not completely started, Uchiha Madara and Third Rakage looked like they were at war, and Third Suchikage Onoki had to come out to make a fight. Although Yi Kang is also dissatisfied with Uchiha Madara's arrogant, but the Alliance of Four Shadows has been initiated, and the Army of Ninjas has also entered the Land of Fire. At this time, they can no longer turn back. If you want to do it, you better know. After all, you can only rely on Uchiha Madara to fight Tekken, not their Four Shadows, let alone the 30,000 Ninja Coalition. Uchiha Madara looked directly into Third Rakage's eyes. As long as Uchiha Madara doesn't trample on their bottom line, no matter how defiant and arrogant they are, they can only endure it. Third Rakage let out a roar, and a dazzling lightning-style chakra burst out from his whole body. There is only one chance. A warm-up match before the fight with Carl. Chapter 154 Carl, Seven-Tailed Beast Bombs are enough for a meeting gift. Please subscribe to the sixth update. Rakage, the bigger picture matters. As a Jinchuriki in one of the Four Shadows, Yagura's anger is even stronger than that of Third Rakage, but he dare not show it, so he can only suppress this anger in the deepest part of his heart. Mr. Madara, I lost my composure. But let's talk ugly first, I don't care about anything else, whatever you say, the premise is. I is alive. He lives, I listen to you, he dies. Let's die. Facing Three Shadows' repeated persuasion, Third Rakage finally took a deep breath and suppressed the idea of doing something. The fish will die, but the net will not necessarily break. But I also congratulate you, you made the right decision again. When Uchiha Madara heard the words, instead of, 010, being angry, she laughed. I hope so too. Third Rakage dropped a sentence, and then said to Erwei Jinchuriki you wooden golem. 
Listen to Mr. Madara and use the tailed beast bomb. Even third rakage bowed his head, Yu Wooden Golem naturally didn't dare to say anything, and the other Jinchuriki were even more silent. Hurry up and do it. Uchiha Madara jumped and stepped on Seven Tails Chome's head. Boom. The Jinchuriki in each village looked at each other, obviously they belonged to different ninja villages, but except for the Pomelo Wooden Golem and Mizukaj Citrus Yugura, they were the same in their ninja villages, and they were not regarded as people by their ninja villages. Going to Uchiha Madara treated them like nothing, which made them want to hug each other to keep warm. However, they only made eye contact. In front of Uchiha Madara and the Four Shadows, they didn't dare to say anything, and they mobilized the Tail Beast Chakra in their bodies one after another. With one force after another, the evil tailed beast chakra came out from the bodies of five Jinchuriki, and soon the Jinchuriki headed by Yugura began to turn into tailed beasts, quickly turning into small tailed beasts. Not enough. Uchiha Madara frowned slightly. With this tailed beast chakra, even if you can barely make up a tailed beast bomb, it is not even qualified as a pyrotechnic that ignites the fourth ninja world war. Such lackluster fireworks and such a shabby appearance were not what he wanted. Bang. Fangpo sensed Uchiha Madara's dissatisfaction, and all the Jinchuriki dared not hold back anymore. Following the blood-red chakra beams of light soaring into the sky, straight into the sky, filling the entire coalition with an ominous and evil aura, Feng Zibo Madara's slightly frowned brows finally eased. Under the watchful eyes of one after another, the five Jinchuriki, Fenfu, Wooden Golem, Yugura, Lao Zi, and Han, underwent complete tailed beast transformation at the same time, from a half-tailed beast with some human characteristics just now to a full-fledged beast. There are only huge tailed beasts that look like mountains entrenched in the Konoha forest. One tail watching cranes, two tails Matabi, three tails. Four tails Monkey King, five tails Kokuo, six tails Saiken, seven tails Chomei. As soon as seven tailed beasts exuding terror chakra appeared from the Konoha forest, the seven different tailed beasts with different nature transformation, chakra, vented like a storm, and the surrounding terrain began to change continuously. The continuous forest in the sight of many ninjas disappeared at an astonishing speed, and all the vegetation was uprooted at an astonishing speed by the shock wave caused by the star beast Jonkila. Facing the sudden storm of the tailed beast chakra, except for Uchiha Madara, four shadows, and elite Jonin level ninjas, all were blown back again and again, not daring to approach Jinchuriki at all. This kind of chakra, is finally much more presentable. Carl, seven tailed beast bombs are enough for a meeting gift. The corner of Uchiha Madara's mouth slightly raised, letting the chakra storm blow on his face. Although the eight tails and the nine tails that he cares about most are missing, it is still good to gather seven tailed beasts as his first debut after Uchiha Madara's return. Tailed beast bomb, five fully tailed Jinchuriki, plus two wild-tailed beasts controlled by Uchiha Madara's eternal Mangekyo Sharingan pupil power, opened their mouths together. Red and blue chakra particles like snowflakes and stardust filled the sky of Konoha Forest, and then under the control of Jinchuriki and Tailed Beast, they quickly turned into seven purple-black-tailed beast bombs that exude a suffocating light. Don't get me wrong, Uchiha Madara stood on top of Seven Tails Chome, looking down towards the valley of the end. Call out. The moment he finished speaking, the Tailed Beast bomb suspended in front of the mouths of the Seven Tails shot out at the same time. Boom. Accompanied by a loud bang, the seven-tailed beast bombs rolled up a terrifying air wave with a bang, pulled out seven ravines that crushed everything in the vast and boundless woodleaf forest, and bombarded directly towards the distant valley of the end and go. What a mighty chakra, it's a tail beast, and there are seven of them. No, there are seven chakras with extremely terrifying density flying towards us. Although the allied forces of the four villages are still ten kilometers away from the valley of the end, the size of the tailed beast and the chakra are so huge that almost the moment Jinchuriki completely transforms into a tailed beast and condenses the tailed beast bomb, the sentient ninjas in the valley of the end have already noticed. Especially as early as 3.4 summoning two great toad sages, Jiraiya who turned on sage mode, and Yamanaka Hayi and others were the first to perceive the movements of Jinchuriki and tailed beasts. Master Carl, the four shadows have launched an attack, tailed beast bomb. Yamanaka jumped and landed on the stone statue of Uchiha Madara opposite Carl. No way. In the past, when Carl retreated to the mountains, some people dared to step on Carl's stone statue, but now that Carl is out of the mountain, he is standing on top of the statue that is taller than the god of ninja and ninja shira, but there is no Konoha shinobi those who dare to step on the stone statue of the ninja hero as they did in the past. Chapter 155 The Ways of Greeting Among the Three Masters of the Ninja World Part 1 Please subscribe. It's not those little guys from Saiyan, it's Madara. This kind of handwriting is probably from his hand. Only he would choose this noisy way to say hello. Carl sat cross-legged on top of the stone statue and corrected what Yamanaka had said. Launching seven-tailed beast bombs before we meet, is this just a greeting? When Yamanaka heard this, he couldn't help showing a look of shock on his face. As the way of greeting among the three masters of Sengoku so horrible. After turning on sage mode, Jiraiya, who has explosively improved perception and all aspects of body functions, immediately caught Carl's words. This is too exaggerated. Hitaki Kakashi, who was following Namikaze Minato, had a pair of dead fish eyes. Take seven-tailed beast bombs to say hello. Only Sengoku Sanji dared to do this, and someone else would die before finishing greeting. Namikaze Minato smiled wryly, this way of greeting is really unbearable for most people. Before anyone arrived, 715 tailed beast bombs had already smashed over. 
Without the slightest precaution, suddenly facing seven-tailed beast bombs, who can withstand the size of the ninja world? At least, since the end of the ninja village era, no one has been able to resist seven-tailed beast bombs for so many years. Even Third Rakage, who had activated lightning style the strongest armor, faced seven-tailed beast bombs, and it was still reduced to ashes in an instant. Uchiha Obito, who always talked the most, didn't speak, just bowed his head silently. At this moment, he couldn't help but ask himself. Why everyone has the surname Uchiha, but the level is so far apart. Uchiha Madara over there directly greeted Carl with seven-tailed beast bombs, but his Uchiha couldn't even play Shadow Clone well. Dad, if teacher Carl greets you like this, can you take it? Might Guy couldn't help asking Might Die beside him. Because his identity was revealed in the land of water, even if he was only a student, he was not Carl's disciple, but with such a relationship, and Might Day's unfathomable strength, Might Die was no longer 10,000 years Genin, but he is the leader of Konoha's Jonin. Its status is comparable to that of Mu Yi Baya in the past. As Might Day's son, Might Guy, who was often cast aside, ridiculed, and ridiculed in the village, has also transformed himself into a physical fitness genius sought after by everyone. No one, not only because of his identity as the son of Might Dai, but also because Might Dai brought him to see Carl, not only won Carl's favor, but even pointed out Might Guy several times. This also led to earth-shaking changes in both Might Dai and Might Guy's status, reputation, and identity in Konoha. In the eyes of Serutobi Hiruzen and others, Might Guy is not only the bridge between Konoha Cenozoic and Carl in the future, but also the heir of eight inner gates. That's right, after Might Dai returned from the country of water, the news that he cultivated the eight inner gates formation has been confirmed. Even if the power of the eight inner gates formation cannot be tested, but just opening the seventh gate can defeat Orochimaru, one of the Sanin no head, even beat Jiraiya in sage mode, which is enough to cause a sensation in the whole Konoha. Such a greeting, it is estimated that your father can only do it once in his life. Might Dai thought about it seriously, then gave a thumbs up. That's right, the eight gates were wide open, revealing the eight inner gates formation, and he was confident in greeting Carl this way. It's just that after the fight, people are gone. But even so, when he said these words, all the Konoha executives present were terrified and moved. As expected of a father. I will definitely work hard to become a person like my father who can say hello to teacher Carl. Quote. Might Guy didn't feel that there was anything wrong at all, and Jingxi's blood was ignited. If it's my son, you can definitely do it. After all, Mr. Carl said, you will be a man who can surpass me in the future. Might Guy patted Might Guy's head, ignoring the weird eyes around him, and encouraged him with blood on his face. Beyond Might Mr. Dai, not only did his father say that, even Carl had such a high opinion of him. I will not let dad and teacher Carl down. Serutobi Hiruzen, Jiraiya, Orochimaru, Namikaze Minato couldn't help but look sideways at Might Guy when they heard this. A man who was stronger than everyone in the ninja village era. If he can really surpass Might Guy, he may really become the number one person under the three heroes, and he will also prove it in the first generation for shadows. Since 890 said so, maybe Might Guy really has this qualification. Apart from Taijutsu, his ninjutsu, genjutsu, the use of ninjutsu, etc. are all messed up. Since Carl gave Might Guy such a high evaluation, there must be unimaginable aptitude hidden in this watermelon-headed boy. One day, I will become a stronger man than everyone in this era. Might wear the character, he's heard about it. Master Carl thinks so highly of this son. They don't have Mu Yi by Ya's vision, but they believe Carl does. After all, he had heard similar words from his father White Fang a long time ago. Might Guy said excitedly, Hitaki Kakashi on the side heard this, but looked at Might Guy carefully. Like teacher Carl said, better than anyone. That is someone who will never speak wild words. Even if the current Might Guy is not very powerful, it is still worthy of attention. But can he really do it? Chapter 156 We can't let the tailed beasts disturb our heroes as soon as they come, part 2 please subscribe. Uncle Carl, let me come. Even though it's Uchiha Madara saying hello, he wasn't the one launching the tailed beast bomb. Since it is a tailed beast, let me solve it. Uzumaki Kashina withdrew his gaze from Might Guy, Might Guy and his son, and turned to Carl. Unlike Serutobi Hiruzen and others who would be moved by the conversation between the father and son, she acted calmly. Not only because she was watching when Carl gave the evaluation, but more importantly, he had seen Might Guy's practice. When Might Guy practiced with his father, Might Guy, the practice could already be described as desperate. But the few times Carl pointed out, it was beyond the scope of risking one's life, but not at all, but Might Guy persisted, and was still alive to complete the training arranged by Carl. It was also at that moment that she was sure that Might Guy would become a great weapon in the future, and would definitely surpass the current powerhouses such as Third Hokage, Sanin, and Golden Flash. You go, Carl who was sitting cross-legged on top of the stone statue, just wanted to get up when he heard the Vortex Kashina's clear battle. We can't let the seven supporting characters disturb our hero as soon as they arrive. Uzumaki Kashina smiled, her pretty face was full of radiant smiles. Also, Carl glanced at Uzumaki Kashina, then nodded with a smile. This time, I won't be slow. When Uzumaki Kashina heard this, when he turned his head to look in the direction of the seven big-tailed beasts, he had already covered his body with a blood-red, evil-tailed beast coat. And many more. Seeing this, Carl frowned. What's the matter? Uncle Carl. 
Uzumaki Kashina was just about to complete the full tail beast transformation in one go, and immediately showed nine tails, but when he heard Carl's words, he paused slightly. Aren't you a perfect Jinchuriki? Carl asked. Err, although I can fully transform into a tailed beast, I'm not perfect Jinchuriki yet. The mutual understanding between you and the tailed beast that you mentioned before, I think it is impossible for me and nine tails to achieve in this lifetime. The other tail beasts are fine, but the road to mutual understanding between nine tails and nine tails dachung is too difficult. Uzumaki Kashina smiled sarcastically. Ever since Carl mentioned that nine tails is different from other tailed beasts, as long as they reach an understanding, they can become a different Jinchuriki, she tried to communicate with nine tails a lot. But every time they didn't chat for two or three sentences, either she was irritated by nine tails and directly tied each other into rice dumplings with adamantine sealing chains, or nine tails was irritated by him and grinned directly. That's true, that's right, after all, that fox is famous for being arrogant and stubborn. At that time, Hashirama, Madara, and Mito tried all their methods but failed to make nine tails return to their hearts. In the end, they could only use their own methods to control nine tails perfectly. If you follow the normal path, it is almost impossible to become a perfect Jinchuriki in the way of understanding. Quote. Carl nodded. Except for Sage of Six Paths, the creator of the Tailed Beast, only Ashura and its chakra reincarnation can reach a mutual understanding with Nine Tails, but it is only possible. Others, whether it is Uchiha Madara, Uzumaki Mito, use their own unique methods to perfectly master the power of Nine Tails. Even Senju Hashirama, one of Ashura's reincarnations, forcibly dominates Nine Tails with wood style. So, I think that rather than understanding each other, focusing on me as I am now and never getting used to that stinky fox, is the correct way for me to get along with Nine Tails. When Uzumaki Kashina finished speaking and was about to completely transform into a tailed beast, Carl said something that made her look bright. Since you help the old man get ahead, then the old man can't let your efforts be in vain. Let's do this. Since the conventional method doesn't work, I will use my own method to help you become a perfect Jinchuriki. As soon as Carl said this, Uzumaki Kashina's lightning became hot. It's nothing if she didn't know the benefits of the perfect Nine Tails Jinchuriki before, but after knowing it, wouldn't she want to master it? After all, that is the strongest power among the three masters of Sengoku. Once she masters it perfectly, coupled with her own strength, she can become a powerhouse comparable to, or even surpassed by first generation foreshadows in a matter of minutes. Who can be unmoved by this kind of power? Quote dot quote. Uncle Carl, the tailed beast bomb is about to shoot, can you make it in time? Uzumaki Kashina asked urgently, if it's too late, why would the old man bring it up at this time? Carl raised his right hand while talking. What way? Seeing this, Uzumaki Kashina asked a little angrily. If you don't get along with nine tails, use your fists to get through. After finishing speaking, Carl punched Uzumaki Kashina in the air. Uncle Carl is not going to kill me, grave. Uzumaki Kashina turned pale. Obviously Carl just, Li Wonghao, just punched in place, even if the arm was stretched to the longest, the fist was still some distance away from her, but at the moment Carl punched, everything in her sight disappeared instantly. All that was left was a fist that kept enlarging until it swallowed everything in her sight. Carl UB asterisk 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 D. Unlike Uzumaki Kashina, whose expression was sluggish and whose sight was occupied by fists, after Carl swung his fist, Nine Tails, who was sealed inside Uzumaki Kashina's body, immediately shrank in the corner of the cage with panic on his face. However, no matter how much he retreats, no matter how much he shrinks, he can't change a fist that is as black as ink, entangled with black lightning, so terrifying that it cannot be described in any words, appears in the sealed space out of thin air, and then passes through the cage, light collapsing the sky is rolling towards him straightly. Chapter 157 Uzumaki Kashina's Karama Mode Part 3 for Subscription all right. Just when Uzumaki Kashina was stunned on the spot, his eyes seemed dimmed, and he seemed to lose his soul, Carl's voice suddenly came from his ear. What's good? A gleam appeared in Uzumaki Kashina's eyes, as if he had just returned to his soul. You will know if you try to transform into a tailed beast again. Carl chuckled, pretending to be mysterious. Mysterious. Uzumaki Kashina said in a low voice, considering that the tailed beast bomb was about to fly, she didn't bother to find out what happened just now, and she didn't even bother to ask nine tails, and directly carried out tailed beast transformation as usual. But what made her a little stunned was that when the tailed beast chakra came from nine tails, she didn't feel any hatred, evil, or ominous aura to affect her spiritual will. Not only that, but in the past, nine tails chakra, which contained all the negative emotions in the entire ninja world, seemed to be sucked clean by the world. Not only did the negative emotions of resentment disappear, even the originally 733 nine tails chakra, which was as red as blood and more violent than wind and thunder, became extremely pure and peaceful, and mobilizing it was as easy and simple as controlling your own chakra in the body even rich and effortless, as this really nine tails chakra. Aware of this change, Uzumaki Kashina was stunned. Normally, even if there is a vortex physique and a seal to suppress her, when she transforms into a tailed beast, her spirit and body will be corroded by nine tails chakra, but now she seems to be the master of nine tails chakra. With the movement of her thoughts, nine tails chakra poured out like Wang Yang Si. Boom. After a deafening explosion, everyone noticed that Uzumaki Kashina standing on the top of the Senju Hashirama stone statue suddenly burst out with extremely dazzling and brilliant golden light. 
Even the sky above the valley of the end, bathed and irradiated by the golden light, is covered with a layer of golden coat. What a powerful chakra! Yamanaka's face suddenly changed, and his body backed up again and again. Strange, releasing such an amazing nine tails chakra, why can't I feel the slightest bit of evil and ominous breath? Jiraiya looked suspiciously and shocked at Uzumaki Kashina, who was shrouded in golden light and could not see clearly. Does nine tails still have this power? Orochimaru is also incredible. So pure. At this point, the chakra that emanates with Kashina feels like, in the warm sunshine. It is completely different from the feeling of uneasiness and trembling in the past when the tail was turned into a beast. What happened? I am not sure as well. I just saw Master Carl swinging his fist, and Master Kashina became like this. All the Konoha shinobi around the valley of the end stared up at Uzumaki Kashina, dumbfounded. In the past, when Uzumaki Kashina turned into a tailed beast, they couldn't help but feel repulsion, disgust, and fear in their hearts. But now, looking at Uzumaki Kashina bathed in Golden Nine Tails Chakra, all Konoha Shinobi fans just feel extremely warm and relaxed, and want to get close to her involuntarily. I didn't expect to see the power of Nine Tails in this posture with my own eyes. The Fukusaku Sento BFAA, on Jiraiya's shoulders widened his toad eyes, and his face was full of emotion. Yes, the child's father, Uzumaki Kashina staring deeply at Shima Senen. This kind of Nine Tails power, even they who are second only to Great Toad Sage in Mount Mayoboku have never seen it with their own eyes, only heard it mentioned by Great Toad Sage. Two Immortals, what's going on here? When Jiraiya heard the two Immortals whispering in his ears, he became even more suspicious. Sarutobi Hiruzen looked at Uzumaki Kashina, and a thought came to his mind. But if one day, someone can wash away the resentment in Nine Tails' heart, they will regain the true power of Nine Tails. It doesn't look like it. As this tail beastization. Konoha, is there another ninja stronger than the old man, Third Hokage? There are no nine soaring fox tails as everyone expected, nor the body of nine tails that makes the body and mind tremble. As soon as Immortal Shima's words fell, the entire valley of the end and the nine tails chakra where all Konoha shinobi were bathed in golden light slowly dispersed. There are sharp horns formed by chakra on the head, and Uzumaki Kashina with six hooked jade emerges from the opening of the clothes. The old man once mentioned that nine tails are different from other tailed beasts. Seeing Uzumaki Kashina, whose image has changed drastically but still maintains a human form, all the Konoha shinobi fans were stunned. I've seen Kashina fully tailed before, but it doesn't seem to be as good as the current figure when using medium power. That's right. This can only be activated if Jinchuriki and Nine Tails are connected. Kurama mode. He is the existence closest to the source, but after a thousand years, that power has been filled by the resentment of the ninja world. Isn't tailed beast transformation directly turning into a tailed beast? Uzumaki Kashina came back to his senses, looked down at his hands wrapped in golden Nine Tails chakra, his pretty face was full of disbelief. Although they couldn't understand Uzumaki Kashina's posture at this time, even if they didn't have the ability to perceive, they could still feel the endless chakra from Uzumaki Kashina at this time. Carl looked at Uzumaki Kashina, the corner of his mouth slightly raised. Does Nine Tails still have this power? Chapter 158 How did my Nine Tails connect with Uncle Carl? The fourth update asks for subscription. Kurama mode, Uzumaki Kashina was slightly taken aback when he heard this. Tail beasts have names. The reason why the relationship between Jinchuriki and tail beasts is bad, no matter how many years they get along, the most important reason is that ninjas only name tail beasts according to the number of tails. Learn the name of, tail beast. It's like when you get along with a person and have known them for decades, but you don't even know their name, don't want to know it, let alone call it, just call the other person's nickname that is not very nice, even the most basic respect no, do you think the relationship can be good? When Carl said this, many Konoha ninjas were stunned. Indeed, they never thought that the tailed beast had a name, and they didn't want to know it, let alone shout it. Ninjas have been walking on the edge of life and death all year round. No matter how sunny and kind their original character is, they will walk on the edge of life and death again and again. After seeing all kinds of ugliness in the ninja world, their temperament gradually changes. Such things as tailed beasts having names, and tailed beasts themselves are extremely concerned about names, where would they think about it? No wonder I have such a bad relationship with nine tails. Uzumaki Kashina suddenly realized, no wonder she's been trying to understand Nine Tails lately, only to find things worse than before. Kurama, don't think about it, he is different from other tailed beasts. It doesn't matter if you know his name, it doesn't matter how good you are. Because Nine Tails can perceive people's good and evil, so, your little thoughts can't be hidden in front of him. Quote. Carl shook his head, then Uncle Carl, how did you get Nine Tails to connect with me? A trace of cold sweat broke out on Uzumaki Kashina's forehead. No wonder his recent relationship with Nine Tails is worse than in the past. It turned out that he realized that he went to him with the idea of becoming a perfect Jinchuriki. Who told you that Kurama has a connection with you? Carl looked at Uzumaki Kashina strangely. Didn't you say that Kurama mode can only be activated if there is a bond between Jinchuriki and Nine Tails? If Nine Tails didn't connect with me, how did I get this Kurama mode? Uzumaki Kashina said, there is nothing wrong with this, so there is a connection between the old man and Kurama now. Now he is looking at the face of his old age, and he is using Luang for you. Quote. What Carl said made Uzumaki Kashina feel bad. My tailed beast is connected with you, Uncle Carl. Is this something humans can do? 
Uzumaki Kashina was stunned. Is the nine tails sealed in his own body, or is it sealed in Carl West? Why is the tail beast in my body connected with others? Suddenly, she felt that her Karama mode was not good. Also, does this kind of operation still exist? Yamanaka who was not far away broke into a cold sweat. The connection between Jinchuriki and Tail Beast is unheard of. It is even more incredible that the nine tails sealed in Uzumaki Kashina's body are connected with humans other than Jinchuriki. Don't worry about how the old man did it, as long as you can use Karama mode. Carl spread his hands and said indifferently. All right. Considering the seven tail beast bombs, Uzumaki Kashina didn't bother to pay attention to this aspect, but raised his right hand forward, and under the gaze of nearly 10,000 pairs of eyes below the valley of the end, a fox head formed by chakra bloomed all over his body. Chi Chi. As the fox's head opened its mouth wide, two kinds of chakra particles, one blue and one black, converged, and a tail beast bomb glowing with purple light was formed in an instant. Seeking flowers zero. Amazing tail beast bomb condensing speed. Is this Karama mode? Is this kind of chakra control really what Kashina can have? Even Tsunade is nothing more than that. Orochimaru, Jiraiya and others below saw that Uzumaki Kashina condensed the tail beast bomb in an instant, and controlled the extremely violent nine tails chakra extremely finely, all of them felt unbelievable. Many of them have seen Uzumaki Kashina fully tailed and cast tailed beast bomb. But at that time, it was obviously extremely difficult for Uzumaki Kashina to control the tailed beast chakra, and it was not as subtle as it is now. The cohesion speed of the tailed beast bomb is incomparable to the current one. What a powerful force. Uzumaki Kashina was also very surprised, but Nine Tails didn't reach an understanding with herself, nor did she have a connection with herself, but a connection with Uncle Carl, and she couldn't help feeling depressed. The tail beast in the body connects with other people's minds, so I must have pioneered Jinchuriki. Forget it, let's talk about it later. The most important thing now is to get those tailed beast bombs. The whirlpool Kashina suppressed the depression in her heart, and a pair of blood-red vertical pupils flashed a cold color. By itself, she has a good perception ability, and after turning on Karama mode, combined with Nine Tails' good and evil perception ability, her perception ability has undergone unprecedented changes. Obviously the seven-tailed beast bombs were still a few kilometers away, but she could accurately sense the movement trajectories of the seven-tailed beast bombs, as well as the malice contained in the tailed beast bombs. Tailed Beast Bomb. After locking onto the seven tailed beast bombs, Uzumaki Kashina let out a cold cry in his heart, and the tailed beast bomb suspended in front of his hands shot out ten times in an instant like cannonballs. Chapter 159 Whirlpool Hits 7. The fifth update asks for subscription. Boom. As the tailed beast bomb was condensed by Uzumaki Kashina, and pierced the sky like a meteor, many people saw seven purple black chakra spheres flying in the distance. Seeing this scene, everyone knows that this is the tailed beast bomb released by all the Jinchuriki and tailed beasts of the Ninja Village Coalition forces. As a pair of sevens okay. Just when Yamanaka Hayi, Nara Shikuju and others were sweating, the eight-tailed beast bombs collided fiercely. The expected shocking explosion or evenly matched collision did not occur, but at the moment when the eight-tailed beast bombs collided with each other, seven-tailed beast bombs released by the power of the seven-song-tailed beasts, seven kingdoms, it's like a balloon meeting an iron ball. Boom. There was a loud noise, accompanied by terrifying air waves spreading in all directions, and at the same time, the seven-tailed beast bombs that encountered the nine-tails tailed beast bomb exploded instantly, directly under the watchful eyes of nearly 10,000 Konoha Shinobi followers. A wave of seven hits. Crushed. With one against seven, it actually smashed seven of the enemy's tailed beast bombs. This, is too strong. This appalling scene stunned almost everyone. None of them expected that the collision between tailed beast bombs would be like this. There is no equal strength, and no one is at a disadvantage, and some just make the enemy collapse at the first touch. What are you thinking? I really thought the name of the strongest tailed beast was called for nothing. It's just seven tailed beasts, but the seven tailed beast bombs last a second longer as an insult to Karama's reputation as the strongest. Carl sneered, there was no surprise or surprise on his face. A half pack of nine tails, this is the first time I entered Karama mode, I can't control nine tails chakras Uzumaki Naruto very well. Not to mention that at this time, Uzumaki Kashina has a nine tails in his body. In particular, Uzumaki Kashina's control over tailed beasts far exceeds that of Uzumaki Naruto in the early days of the Fourth World War. After all, Nine Tails is an uncle in front of Uzumaki Naruto, but in front of Uzumaki Kashina is often tied up, hung up and beaten. There is no need to reach an understanding, and you can completely tail the beast with your own strength and release the tailed beast bomb, let alone Uzumaki Kashina after entering Karama mode. The same share of chakra can have completely different powers in the hands of different people. Like the eternal Mangekio Sharingan, in the hands of Uchiha Sasuke it is a sunny pillar, but in the hands of Uchiha Madara it is a completely different matter. It's not over yet. The corners of Uzumaki Kashina's lips twitched slightly. She was the only one besides Carl who knew the outcome was like this. Under her gaze, after smashing seven tailed beast bombs, the tailed beast bomb she condensed continued unabated, and flew straight towards Uchiha Madara in the Four Village Coalition. No, our tailed beast bomb is crushed. How is that possible? Those are seven tailed beast bombs. Could it be an iron fist shot? There are also capable people in the Four Village Coalition. Although the level of perception of ninjas is not as good as that of Yamanaka Hayi, but with the power of Shikyun and the increase of various ninja tools, the moment the seven-tailed beast bombs were crushed by Uzumaki Kashina, Sikaj immediately learned of this. 
one result. It's not an iron fist shot. Just when Seekage and many ninjas were in doubt, Uchiha Madara suddenly said in an unquestionable tone. If it weren't for Iron Fist, who else in Konoha could crush seven-tailed beast bombs in an instant? Third Rakage said in disbelief. If it's not Tekken, it's the other Konoha shinobi. In fact, he and Jifu did not reach an understanding, let alone a mutual understanding. Yugura can't believe that Uzumaki Kashina can control the tailed beast to such an extent. This ability to control tailed beasts would be fine if it was used on other tailed beasts, but if it could be used on nine tails, he would have to look at it with admiration. Although he, Senju Hashirama, Uzumaki Mito, and Carl can perfectly control the power of the tailed beast, and it is any one, they have adopted their own methods, basically directly suppressing the will of the tailed beast, using their own will to replace tailed beast's will. For example, his Sharingan pupil power control, Senju Hashirama's wood style suppression, and Uzumaki Mito's seal are all suppressed by his own blood succession power and even the will of the tailed beast, and then forcibly dominate all the power of the tailed beast. Speaking of Uzumaki Kashina, his tone is full of unconcealed appreciation. I thought that after Hashirama and Mito died, Konoha wouldn't even have a decent opponent. I didn't expect that after so many years, there would be a second Mito in Konoha, no, this younger generation of Uzumaki has done better than Mito. Konoha's Nine Tails Jinchuriki can do this. Yi Kang couldn't believe it. Uchiha Madara looked up at the sky, his eyes spanned a long distance, and he had a panoramic view of the Nine Tails Tailed Beast Bomb. If there was, Dei's situation would not have been precarious before Iron Fist came out of the mountain. But after Uzumaki Juksen 2.09 made a shot, he saw the ability to control tailed beasts that was different from them. But why didn't he know that Konoha still has such a master? Nine Tails Jinchuriki. Don't think he can completely transform into a tailed beast, but he also used his own method. Nine Tails. Chapter 160 Amazing, the junior of the Uzumaki family. It's a pity that you met me Madara. Did that Vortex Jinchuriki become the perfect Jinchuriki like by? Third Rakage's face was uncertain. Whether it is or not, what we should consider now is not why the opponent is so strong, but how to block this terrifying tailed beast bomb. Onogi said as he slowly lifted into the air. This is the Nine Tails Tailed Beast Bomb that can crush seven tailed beast bombs in an instant. Apart from Uchiha Madara, he thought that only his old bones could resist. Step aside. But when Onogi had just risen to a height of several meters, Uchiha Madara lowered his arms around his chest. Mr. Madara, do you want to make a move? Onoki was a little surprised, but immediately backed away. Uchiha Madara took the initiative to make a shot, which was heavy no matter how you looked at it. Compared with Uchiha Madara's passive response to the battle, and their four village coalition forces are used as cannon fodder, he is more happy to see Uchiha Madara take the initiative. HMPH. Since this junior from the Whirlpool family is coming for me, of course I can't pretend that I didn't see anything. 15. Uchiha Madara snorted coldly. Onoki boy, go aside quickly, don't hinder me from dancing. Others couldn't notice it, but he naturally noticed that Uzumaki Kashina's tailed beast bomb was flying towards Uchiha Madara instead of flying towards the allied forces of the four villages. Is he going to make a move? The power of Ninja Shura. Now we can take a good look at it. Rinnegan plus Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, should be able to fight Iron Fist. Third Rakage, Kutaki Yagura, Hakura and the retreating Onoki all stared at Uchiha Madara intently. The legendary Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, and the Rinnegan, who used to exist only in fairy tales. No matter what kind of power it is, it is extremely terrifying. But now, these two kinds of eyes are controlled by Uchiha Madara at the same time, which is why their four shadows dare to fight against Iron Fist. If Uchiha Madara is still the former Uchiha Madara, they will say nothing and agree to Third Rakage's alliance proposal. Knowing is knowing, but the power of Rinnegan, even the power of Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, they have only heard about it, and have not witnessed it with their own eyes. Now that they finally have a chance, they are naturally observing carefully to see if they can fight Iron Fist. The junior of the Uzumaki family, you are amazing. It's a pity that you met me, Madara. Uchiha Madara jumped and landed on the top of a big tree. A pair of scarlet bloody three Tomo Sharingan turned into a Rinnegan exuding a noble pupil power like a god looking down on all living beings. Although you may not be able to see it, this is, the power of reincarnation that surpasses the power of the tailed beast. He quietly looked at the tailed beast bomb flying from afar and getting closer to him, then he raised his right hand unhurriedly, and grabbed the tailed beast bomb. When Saiyan and 30,000 ninjas saw this scene, their hearts tightened suddenly, as if they were pinched by a big hand. But in the next second, they were all stunned. The tailed beast bomb, which is huge and contains enough nine tails chakra to easily wipe out the lives of 30,000 ninjas here, was grabbed by Uchiha Madara's right hand, like a stone caught in a vortex. The huge tailed beast bomb keeps shrinking at a speed visible to the naked eye. In an instant, nine tails tailed beast bomb, second only to ten tails, was completely absorbed by Uchiha Madara with every gesture. Absorbed. This is the tailed beast bomb that smashed the alliance of the seven tailed beasts. Rinnegan's pupil power is really terrifying. The four shadows looked at each other, and they all saw horror in each other's eyes. They hope that Uchiha Madara is very strong, and it is best to compete with Carl, but it is only a competition. If it is stronger than Carl, it is definitely not a good thing. After all, even if Carl is really defeated, it means that there is one more person stronger than Carl in the ninja world, and this person is still the ruthless Shura of the ninja world. 
It is estimated that after the war, their situation will definitely not be better than before, or even worse. However, there was no arrow to turn back when the bow was opened, no matter what plan Sang had in mind at this time, he could only bite his teeth and hit the scalp. Withdrew from the battlefield at this time, even if Carl didn't care about them, Uchiha Madara in front of him would wipe them out in a flash. Nice chakra, to be able to control the power of the complete nine tails to such an extent, you are indeed doing better than the Vortex Mito. Among the Jinchuriki I have seen, there is no one stronger than you, but that's all. Quote. Uchiha Madara ignored the changing expressions of 844 shadows, but carefully perceived the tailed beast bomb absorbed by him. The junior of the Uzumaki family, you think you can yell at me Uchiha Madara with the power of only one nine tails, you are a hundred years too early. At the same time as the deep and haughty voice fell, he raised his other hand and made a gesture of seal. Boom. The surging blue chakra gushes out, turning into an incomplete Suzano covering his body. What does he want to do? Is that Suzano? To be able to form seals with Uchiha Madara, so Suzano can also perform ninjutsu. It's still some distance away from the Valley of the End, isn't he trying to launch ninjutsu from such a long distance? Seeing this, Saing's face was full of disbelief. Since ancient times, only tailed beasts can carry out ultra-long distance strikes. But now Uchiha Madara seems to want to break this inherent rule. Chapter 161 You are not good enough, let Carl come. The first update asks for subscription. Tengai Shinsei. The deep, chilling, and confident voice swept through the entire ninja coalition like a storm. Obviously after Uchiha Madara sealed, there was nothing but the incomplete Suzano, but everyone felt an indescribable depression. Especially the stronger the ninja, the stronger the depression in his heart. That kind of dull, unreasonable panic filled the hearts of every ninja, making it difficult for the experienced and determined coalition ninjas to breathe. You are not good enough, let Carl come. Uchiha Madara retracted his hands and looked towards the Valley of the End with both eyes, as if he was looking directly at the man who sat cross-legged in the Valley of the End and suppressed him for an age. Boom. Before, sighing and other ninjas were puzzled. They all understood why they suddenly felt a blockage in their chest, which was very uncomfortable. But when Uchiha Madara withdrew his hands, the light falling from the sky gradually became dim, and after a huge shadow enveloped the woodleaf forest, they finally understood. As this human power, the three masters of the ninja world are all monsters of this level. It's not a dimensional existence at all. Saing's eyes widened, and he looked up at the huge meteorite falling from the sky, his faces were filled with horror. This is simply not a power that humans can master. Among them, the ninja from Iwagakur was the most shocked. They are all ninjas who are good at manipulating earth and rocks, but compared with the meteorite that fell from above and covered several kilometers, their earth style is like children playing with mud, which is extremely ridiculous. Just as the Four Shadows and the Ninja Alliance were shocked by the power of Uchiha Madara, Konoha F4, Sanin, Golden Flash and others far away in the Valley of the End also stared straight at the terrifying meteorite falling from the sky. Who can tell me what's going on, backquote. Is this also the power of the Seven Tailed Beasts? No, it's not a tailed beast, just now I felt a terrifying chakra appearing from the coalition forces. Just when Serutobi Hiruzen and others were dumbfounded and couldn't accept it, Yamanaka shouted loudly. It's Uchiha Madara. Everyone was stunned for a while, and then they felt cold physically and mentally. After a distance of nearly 10 kilometers, a meteorite hits. Is this still the ninja's way of fighting? This is already directly promoted to the level of mythology. Is this the kind of character that Carl Uncle overwhelmed during the Sengoku era? Tsunade couldn't help turning his head to look at Carl, his pretty face was slightly moved. Although he hasn't seen Uchiha Madara yet, but the opponent's shot made him feel the mighty power beyond the ninja village era. That is simply a power that surpasses several dimensions of the contemporary five cages. If it is said that the five shadows are the limit of normal human beings, but the four shadows of the first generation are beyond human beings, or the category of super shadows. As for the three masters of Sengoku, it is a realm that touches the gods. This is simply the power of God. Orochimaru looked at the huge meteorite in the sky with lingering fear. Such power. Even if he devoted half his life to learning, he couldn't resist at all. Uchiha Madara's return gift is really big enough. Jiraiya looked bitter. The sage mode that I am proud of is nothing in front of this kind of divine power. Can only be transferred with flying thunder god. Namikaze Minato holds a handful of flying thunder god Kanai. Move the meteorite, he can do it. But the question is is there really only one such meteorite? With his amount of chakra, one chakra is not a problem, but if there are a few more chakra, the problem will be bigger. Isn't it just a bigger stone? What are you panicking about? No matter how big a pebble is, it's still just a pebble after all, this is just a matter of a tailed beast bomb. Uzumaki Kashina took a deep breath. Facing Uchiha Madara's Tengai Shinsei from super long range, she didn't panic much after being surprised at first. It may be the powers bestowed upon her by Karama Mode, allowing her to transcend the realm of humans as well. This also caused everyone to fear, and Tengai Shinsei, who was feared by everyone, could at most just surprise her, not panic, let alone be overwhelmed. But when Uzumaki Kashina was about to condense the tailed beast bomb, she only felt that Carl, who was sitting cross-legged just now, had appeared in front of him. Quote dot quote. Uncle Carl, this is not enough for you to take action. Uzumaki Kashina was surprised. The old man knows you can stop it. But this guy Madara is greeting the old man, and unlike the seven-tailed beast bombs, this is him personally greeting the old man. 
In terms of emotion and reason, the old old ones have to respond a bit, don't they? Carl glanced lightly at the meteorite that fell like a small island, and his tone was as casual and relaxed as ever. It is not Tengai Shinsei, whom Orochimaru calls the power of God, but an inconspicuous drop of rain. All right, Uzumaki Kashina suppressed the urge to try. Although in Kurama mode, the endless chakra gave her the idea of competing with Uchiha Madara, but she wanted to see how Carl would deal with Tengai Shinsei more than doing it herself. After all, the confrontation between the three masters of Sengoku only existed in the last era. In the era of Ninja Village, there were very few people who had seen the three heroes contend for supremacy. Chapter 162 Power of God In front of the old man, who dares to call himself a god. Second update asks for subscription. Master Carl wants to make a move. Could it be that Master Kashina in this state can't stop the meteorite? No, this should be Master Carl responding to Uchiha Madara. Seeing Carl stand up, many Konoha Shinobi fans were a little surprised at first. Although the meteorite is terrifying, it is very visually and spiritually shocking, but the Konoha Shinobi standing here has not only experienced many battles, but also has seen Carl make a move and witness the greatness of the ninja world. They can withstand more than many ninjas of the Four Villages Alliance. Among other things, just Uzumaki Kashina with Kurama mode turned on, they all believe that the other can smash the meteorite. But soon, people with delicate thoughts such as Orochimaru and Uchiha Fugaku realized that it was not that Uzumaki Kashina couldn't bear it, but that Carl was responding to Uchiha Madara. Before, the tailed beast bomb was launched by Jinchuriki and tailed beast, so Uzumaki Kashina can shoot it. But now, it's Uchiha Madara who made the shot, so it's normal for Carl to make the shot himself. 547. The battle of the three heroes after an era. I don't know how Master Carl plans to deal with Uchiha Madara's divine power this time. I've never seen a battle of this level, and a battle that spans such a long distance. Seeing that Carl was about to make a move, the attention of all Konoha Shinobi players was focused on him. God's power. Carl moved his ears and chuckled inwardly. Indeed, if you haven't even seen how big the ninja world is, most people will not be involuntarily amazed when they see Tengai Shinsei for the first time, this is simply the power of God. This guy, Madara, was really pretended by him. But it's a pity for you, what you met was an old man. Who dares to call himself a god in front of the old man? Carl slowly raised his head, looking at the tomb of the earth-shattering bricks that swept through the terrifying air waves and exuded an infinite sense of oppression. He didn't fly up BFEJ, as Orochimaru, Tsunade and the others expected, punching like he smashed the Eight-Tails tailed beast bomb in the Valley of the End. Instead, he stood on top of the stone statue and didn't leave at all mean. Chi Chi. Carl's right foot sank under the gazes of nervousness, apprehension, awe, and curiosity. Accompanied by the sound of thunder and lightning, strips of lightning-like black dragon circled his right leg, and after a while of winding and circling, there was a clang, and his entire right leg, including his trousers, was coated with a heavy layer of black luster. Tempest kicked Starfall. In the next second, Carl, who was standing on top of the stone statue, suddenly pulled up his right foot, and swept away with one kick from bottom to top. His movements are neither fast nor slow, and every Konoha shinobi in the Valley of the End can clearly see his kicking skills, but it is precisely because of seeing his every movement that all the ninjas are shocked startled. Call out. Because when Carl's right foot swept out like a sickle, there was a sharp whistling sound, and a terrifying air wave swept across the entire Valley of the End. Just a leg lift, sweep kick action triggered a natural disaster like horror wind style. But this is not the place where F4, Sanin, Uzumaki Kashina, Namikaze Minato and others are terrified. What was really shocking was the black slashing wave that was kicked out by Carl across the sky, like a dragon flying in the sky, and like an eagle spreading its wings. Bang. Looking at the chopping wave that put Buddha to occupy the entire boundary of the sky in sight, everyone just felt that their thinking had been frozen. Big. Too big. It is no secret that Carl kicked out the chopping wave with human power. Many Konoha shinobi present have seen the slashing, one of the six moves of Superman in the legend. But they had never seen a chopping wave as big as it was now, like a huge wave. When the slashing wave shot up into the sky like a black line, dividing the sky in half, everyone suddenly discovered that compared to Carl's slashing wave, it seemed that Uchiha Madara's meteorite was not that huge. Is this really the range that physical arts can achieve? No. No more. The many Konoha shinobi players in the Valley of the End looked at each other, and they all fell silent in the end. Jiraiya swallowed hard. The only thing left is a puff of yellow smoke that drifts in the wind and spreads in all directions. Carl. Uncle Carl. In the Sengoku era, was your battle with Uchiha Madara, Shodai like this. The results of it, cut such a huge meteorite into dust that blows away with the wind. This is a huge meteorite that spans several kilometers. Sarutobi Hiruzen wiped the cold sweat from his forehead, but immediately more beads of sweat appeared on his face, forehead, and chin. At the same time, the overwhelming sense of oppression also dissipated. Uzumaki Kashina turned his head and looked straight at Carl beside him with a slight smile, Fang Fu didn't know what kind of sensation his kick just now caused. Some are just a flash of black light, and then a huge meteorite like a small island is swallowed up, and then the valley of the end, which had become a bit dim because of Tengai Shinsei, instantly regained its previous clarity. Just when this idea was born in their hearts, the black slashing wave had already submerged Tengai Shinsei who fell down like a meteorite from the sky. Carl just raised his foot and kicked, and the entire meteorite was swallowed by the chopping wave, leaving only a cloud of dust covering the sky. 
No earth-shattering collisions. Orochimaru opened his snake pupils wide, and his normally indifferent face was now filled with horror. Even if it is a stone as tall as a person, it is not easy to cut it into dust with lightning-style chakra, let alone a meteorite like a small island, and it still needs to be chopped into dust with body skills. Chapter 163 Tengai Shinsei. Have you heard of Uranus? Part 3 asks for subscription. Xiao Ju, what are you thinking about all day long? This is just a greeting, not even a warm-up. Where did the real fight come from? When Carl heard Uzumaki Kashina's words, he couldn't help but be a bit dumbfounded. After all, the ninja world in the ninja village era was too weak. Even the so-called five cages are just five ninja boys who have not grown up and have no experience. As Uchiha Madara said, their level of fighting is not comparable to that of the so-called five shadows. Hearing this, Uzumaki Kashina opened his mouth, but couldn't say anything. Not only her, everyone who heard Carl's words fell into a deep silence. This is a greeting. Meteorites that cover the sky and the sun when they move, chopping waves that span the sky, so people in your era called this kind of thing greeting huh? That's too much. You, Mr. Carl, if this is all called greetings, then what are the three ninja world wars in our era? A bunch of rookies pecking at each other. Although it's just a greeting, it's not over yet. Carl ignored Uzumaki Kashina and others who had once lost the ability to speak, and kept looking at the sky. It's not over yet. As soon as these words came out, Uzumaki Kashina, Tsunade and others involuntarily looked up. Really, with the meteorite being chopped into dust by Carl, the clear sky began to dim again. Immediately afterwards, a hole like a Tionking was forcibly torn out of the thick cloud layer with a puff. Boom. A meteorite that was even bigger than before, like a divine punishment from the gods, wrapped in a shocking red heat wave, quickly fell towards the valley of the end. It's okay. Just kick it again. With the lessons learned from the previous Tempest kick, Uzumaki Kashina said very heartlessly. It was not the second meteorite that fell down, but the second drop of rain. The same move, just use it. Carl chuckled and shook his head, then he didn't intend to make a move at all, but stood quietly at the same spot, watching the meteorite getting closer and closer to him. Hey, hey, Uncle Carl, what are you playing? If you don't want to make a move, give me a word. I can do it too. At the beginning, Uzumaki Kashina was still calm, but gradually, seeing that the meteorite was only a little more than a kilometer away from herself and the others, and Carl still had no intention of making a move, she couldn't help panicking. The old man is not in a hurry, what are you in a hurry for? Carl glanced sideways and glanced at Uzumaki Kashina with a smile. Of course I'm in a hurry. Uzumaki Kashina looked anxious. Even if the tailed beast bomb is condensed in Karama mode, it is a matter of an instant, but it still takes time. The most important thing is that if the meteorite is too close, the tailed beast bomb will explode, and it will definitely affect the Konoha Shinobi in the Valley of the End. No, although I don't know what Uncle Carl is playing, I can't wait any longer. The falling speed of the meteorite is really too fast. Just now, the meteorite was still one kilometer away, but now, only myself is left unwilling. Seeing this, Uzumaki Kashina didn't dare to delay any longer, and raised his hand to gather the tailed beast bomb, but Tsunade grabbed his right hand. Just watch it. Facing Uzumaki Kashina's suspicious eyes, Tsunade was calm. Hey, now I don't even want to see it. Blocked by Tsunade, Uzumaki Kashina felt the meteorite shadow on his body become bigger and bigger, and couldn't help but wryly smiled. At this time, she still had time to condense the tailed beast bomb, but when it exploded at this distance, the Konoha Shinobi below would suffer. However, in the next second, their eyes widened with emotion, and some Konoha shinobi who were weak and not strong enough even sat down on the ground. Comma 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 comma. What is Master Carl trying to do? Carl, who had been motionless all this time, suddenly laughed and said, and then his feet burst out black lightning that was tens of meters long like streamers and dragons. Seeing that Carl still has no intention of doing anything, Jiraiya couldn't bear the experience in her heart. Boom. Monado. Move the meteorite. Faced with the suddenly rising storm, even though many Konoha shinobi subconsciously gathered chakra on the soles of their feet, trying to stick to the ground firmly, but the Konoha shinobi whose strength was lower than Jonan's was still the first in an instant. His vision went dark, his ears buzzed, and then his body uncontrollably fell on his back, and finally he was swept away like fallen leaves blowing in the wind. When Namikaze Minato was in a daze, the stone statue surrounded by the black streamer-like armament hockey had already clanged and was coated with a layer of black metallic luster. But this scene left Serutobi Hiruzen and others puzzled. But these black lightnings didn't wrap around his body, instead they meandered and hovered over the huge stone statue under his feet. After Nuota's stone statue was hardened, Carl, who had been motionless all this time, suddenly raised his right hand, and under the gaze of a pair of dull eyeballs, Carl raised his right hand in the posture of Uranus Tota. Have you heard of the Uranus Star? The loud noise that shook the universe, the overwhelming air waves, and the earth-shattering shock wave exploded above the valley of the end. The Buddha's structure was changed, directly from rock to metal. Yes, Teacher Jiraiya, it seems meaningless to use armament hockey to harden the stone statue under your feet. When Namikaze Minato heard the words, when he was about to perform the Flying Thunder God technique, he was stunned by the picture in front of him. Chapter 164 Yo! Crane Tail, Long Time No See. The fourth update asks for subscription. This, caught, although Uzumaki Kashina, who had Karama mode turned on, 
would not be thrown away like a normal Konoha shinobi, but when Carl's right hand touched the Tengai Shinsei falling from the sky, her body staggered and took a step or two back. But when she stabilized her body, she looked at Carl for the first time, and the expression on her pretty face froze instantly. Single, caught such a big meteorite with one hand, and it was a meteorite that fell down at such an amazing speed. Tsunade, who was also standing not far away, also stared at Carl in disbelief with her dazed eyes wide open. It turns out that he used armament hockey to harden the entire stone statue under his feet for this reason, 610. Orochimaru below the valley of the end looks up to the sky. The huge meteorite that covered the sky and dimmed the light in the valley of the end stopped firmly in midair at this time. Even if he doesn't have the blood inheritance limit in pupil technique, he can still see clearly. On top of the stone statue, Carl raised one hand high at this time, and in the posture of Uranus Tota, he firmly caught the second meteorite released by Uchiha Madara with one hand. He was deeply shocked by that kind of absolute power without any fancy, only the purest, most outrageous, and overbearing. Even with a firm mind like Orochimaru, when he looked at Carl at this moment, the snake's pupils were shrunk to the size of a pinhole, and his eyes were full of horror. As this something humans can do, Sarutobi Hiruzen, Shimura Danzo, Mitokado Homura, the F4 of Zhuanju Shaokan, you look at me, I look at you, and you can see each other's pale face full of horror. Carl's use of the most primitive absolute power to carry the meteorite hard and lift it up to break Tengai Shinsei's impact on their hearts is far greater than the first time the Tempest Kick was used to chop the meteorite. Who will tell me in the future that there is no future in practicing physical arts, that one cannot become a strong man only by practicing physical arts, that only practicing ninjutsu and illusion is the way out for ninjas? I'll blow his head off right away. Jiraiya opened her mouth, then shook her head and smiled wryly. With Carl's physical skills and physique, is there any point in ninjutsu or illusion? No matter what opponent it is, what type of technique it is, break it with one punch. What seals? What chakra? What natural chakra? Just punch it through. Namikaze Minato didn't speak, but just looked down at the flying thunder god Kanai in his hand, with a suspicious expression on his life. At this moment, he seemed to understand a little bit how second Hokage Senju Toborama felt at that time. Even if he comes from the Senju clan, even if he has the best talent in the ninja world, he can overcome the taboos of life and death, he can control the energy space, and he can even touch the soul, but so what? In the face of Carl's absolute power, the ninjutsu talent that is higher than the sky is meaningless, and it looks so pale and powerless. Master Carl must win, Konoha will win. After a brief silence, after the silence, I don't know who shouted first. After the first call of Carl's victory, overwhelming shouts echoed throughout the valley of the end, and spread in all directions. Not far from the valley of the end, sighing in the allied forces of the four villages, faces changed when they heard this mighty cry, and then they all stared wide-eyed, their faces full of horror, and even the morale of the sleepy leaf's side became so Gao Ang couldn't care less. They, as well as the 30,000 coalition ninjas, all stood in place, looking up at the stone statue of the Valley of the End. The man holding the meteorite that covered the sky and the sun with one hand, his eyes, face, and heart became blank. Uchiha Madara's Tengai Shinsei, Carl's Uranus support star. Witness the way the three masters of Sengoku greet each other, and the way they respond to each other, they are all like Namikaze Minato, doubting life. This is not a battle between ninjas at all. The four shadows looked ashen and muttered to themselves. In their view, this is simply a battle beyond the scope of ninjas. The existence of Carl and Uchiha Madara, even if it is just to say hello and respond to each other, the power displayed by each other has surpassed the power system of the ninja village era by several dimensions. It is entirely his own power that has raised the upper limit of the power of the ninja world. Are we, are we going to start a war against such a man? No. Don't be afraid, it's not us who are fighting him, it's Uchiha Madara. That's right, we are not going to face Iron Fist, but Konoha Shinobi. The 30,000 ninjas were terrified one by one, their breathing was short of breath, and their bodies trembled slightly on the spot. If it weren't for the four shadows still standing in front of them, if they didn't think that they also have Uchiha Madara on their side, the so-called Fourth Ninja World War, the coalition army that gathered the power of the four villages would have collapsed 0.8 times before the war started. But even so, none of these coalition ninjas dared to look at Carl. They all had twinkling eyes, pale faces, and their morale had fallen to the bottom. Fighting with this posture, even if you are fighting against Konoha Shinobi, it is estimated that you will not be able to exert 70% to 80% of your strength. Carl. Just when the coalition forces of the four villages were frightened by Carl, who was holding the meteorite with one hand, and his heart was trembling, a figure soared into the sky and landed on the top of Seven Tails Chome flying in midair like a comet. Hey, tail of the crane, long time no see. Carl shifted his gaze to Uchiha Madara, a big smile on his face. Chapter 165 Is it bad to be the third in the ninja world? Why do you keep looking for the two you can't beat? The fifth update asks for subscription. You guys are still as annoying as ever. Originally reunited after a long absence, my heart is still very complicated, and I still have a lot to say to you. But your words made me not want to say anything, I just want to press your head to the ground right now. Uchiha Madara, who was originally aggressive and laughing excitedly, froze suddenly. Carl's sentence of the crane tail, the lethality is too great. From childhood to adulthood, no matter in the Uchiha clan or in the ninja world of the entire Sengoku era, his talents, aptitudes, and talents are all second to third. He was almost insulated from the word crane circle from birth. 
However, that didn't start until he met Carl. Defeated again and again, especially after the name of Sengoku Senji appeared in the ninja world, the man in front of him used to call him the tail of the crane in the past. The question is can you do it? This kind of big talk, in the Sengoku era, you told the old man eight times if not ten or fifteen times. But which time didn't you get pinned down on the ground by the old man and beat you? Although Carl and Uchiha Madara were on edge right away, he was in a surprisingly good mood. After all, this is the last person in the ninja world who is in the same era as him and can talk to him on an equal footing. It's different this time, Uchiha Madara's expression is cold, but her inner feelings are almost the same as Carl's. He was obviously annoyed by Carl's words, but there was a long-lost relaxation, freedom, and joy in his heart. This feeling, since Uchiha Izuna's death, defection from Konoha, and after the fight to the death with Senju Hashirama, he never had it again. Even these years, he has been sure that Carl is still alive, but he still feels an indescribable loneliness. Because, he knew that if there were no accidents, the two might not meet again, after all, the paths were different. But as Carl came out again, he also changed his plan. Until this moment of meeting, he finally had the long-lost happiness. With all due respect to the old man, the old man in you has not seen the factors that would lead to a reversal of our outcome. Whether it's the seven pets raised by the old man, the four shadows by your side, or even the thirty thousand ninjas in front of you, what the old man sees in you is still defeat. Carl said every word, they, stop kidding, a grand and gorgeous stage needs to be decorated with audience seats. A dance that surpasses its predecessors also needs a matching stage. And the Konoha left by Hashirama, as well as Cloud Shinobi, San Shinobi, Mist Shinobi, Rock Shinobi and even the contemporary five shadows left by first generation four shadows, are just suitable as embellishments. Uchiha Madara didn't care about the increasingly ugly faces of all the ninjas present, and was extremely proud, no, it should be said as a matter of course. Madara, you are still the same as before. No matter how much you have experienced, no matter how much your personality has changed, you really haven't changed at all in this respect. Sometimes I really want to ask you something. Carl chuckled lightly upon hearing this. To sum it up in one sentence, Uchiha Madara is a man who pretends with his life. This may be the characteristic of Indra's reincarnation. So is Sunny Pillar, and so is Uchiha Madara. However, there are subtle differences between the two. Sunny Pillar is purely using his own life to pretend, and every pretend is accompanied by a solo fight. As for Uchiha Madara, although he is also pretending with his own life, as long as he does not face himself and Hashirama, he will basically show off the audience. Ask, regardless of the outcome, maybe after today, you and I will be alone. There is no chance to say a word or two like now. Quote. Uchiha Madara sighed inwardly, he is confident that he can beat Carl, but after winning, the last person who can communicate with me on an equal footing will disappear too. The old man still doesn't ask. Seeing Uchiha Madara's sentimental side suddenly, Carl couldn't help taking back what he said just now. Squeaky, this isn't like you. Carl, if you have something to say, just say it, and take it as an opportunity for me to leave your last words. Seeing what Carl said, Uchiha Madara was a little curious. Well, since you are so persistent, then the old man will ask. Isn't it good to be third in the ninja world? There are only two people who can beat you in the ninja world. But why are you so hard to think about always like to find people you can't beat? 1987. Carl saw that Uchiha Madara started to pretend again without saying a few words, so he was not polite. This guy is an enhanced version of Sunny Pillar. As long as you give some color, you dare to open a dying workshop. Uchiha Madara's face darkened. The joy of reunion after a long absence was swept away. At this time, all that remains is the surging fighting spirit and violent anger. The third in the ninja world, that kind of thing is already in the past. Come back this time, you don't think I'm still the same Uchiha Madara as before. Uchiha Madara took a breath and suppressed the inner extinction. Although annoying, but he has too much experience in this kind of thing. In the Sengoku era, when he faced Carl, he had experienced too much. Excuse me for my stupid eyesight, I haven't seen any difference between you and before. It's no different from the tail of the crane in the memory of the old man. Hearing this, Carl first looked at Uchiha Madara seriously, then shook his head. Chapter 166 In the past, you were above me, today, I am above you. Subscribe to Chapter 6. Really, if you can't see it, it can only mean that you, Carl, are a little old and dizzy after a long absence. Uchiha Madara smiled coldly, then raised his right hand and waved gently towards Carl. But it doesn't matter, your eyes have problems, I can let you use your body to feel, recognize, and experience, and then you will understand that you and me today are no longer you and me in the past. In the past, you were above me, today, I am above you. As soon as the words fell, the three black hook jades in his eyes began to rotate, and the cold and ominous pupil power diffused over the woodleaf forest. Obviously it was just the turning of the Guyu, obviously it was just the radiating power of the pupils, and it was only the power of the pupils in the state of the three Guas, but it already made all the ninjas in the audience feel extremely depressed, as if their chests were being suppressed by a mountain. Very blocked, is it really necessary to fight? Carl felt the determination in Uchiha Madara's tone, and the smile on his face gradually subsided. Otherwise, do you think that I brought the allied forces of the four villages here simply to catch up with you? Uchiha Madara said coldly, he has endured it all his life. 
Abandon the original plan. Let go of Uchiha's pride and accept the ugly earth grievances. Everything is to climb over the mountain above his head that has been crushing him for a long time. How could it be possible to give up just because of the joy of reunion after a long absence? If possible, I really don't want to kill you. Carl's tone gradually cooled down. Don't be so arrogant, do you think I'm still the old Uchiha Madara? If you can do it, try it with your fists. I just don't know if your iron fist still has the unrivaled punching power of those days. A cold look appeared on Uchiha Madara's face. The three most embarrassing things in his life. Can't protect the last brother. Got let off by Carl several times. Lost to Senju Hashirama, he can ignore all other things. Only this matter. So far, not only has he not let go of it, but has been brooding on it. To be honest, this day will come, I am not surprised at all, but I didn't expect this day to come so soon. Madara, why did you come so fast? Wouldn't it be nice to live a few more years? Carl sighed, the joy of meeting an old friend in his tone had completely disappeared, replaced by coldness. Boom. After finishing speaking, he threw his right hand violently, and the meteorite that he had been carrying was thrown out by him directly. Is it really good to say such things as victory now? We haven't even started warming up yet. Watching the manual Tengai Shinsei thrown by Carl, Uchiha Madara's scarlet Sharingan spins faster and faster. Completely superior to the five shadows, surpassing the chakra and momentum of the ninja village era, like the continuous tsunami set off by Wang Yang Si, crushing down from the sky. On the battlefield, no matter whether it is the Konoha Shinobi or the four villages' allied forces, they all feel the mountain-like oppression covering their bodies and minds. As strong as the contemporary five cages, as well as Uzumaki Kashina, Namikaze Minato and others who are stronger than the contemporary five cages, drops of cold sweat involuntarily broke out on their foreheads. Let's get you something interesting to watch, Carl. Uchiha Madara raised his right hand, and with five fingers spread, a dazzling blue light instantly bloomed in the sky of Konoha Forest, even covering the sun in the sky for a while. At the moment when the strong light shined, blue laser beams shot out like a storm and wind, and instantly bombarded the meteorite that Carl threw towards him. Bang bang bang. With a burst of loud noises, under the shroud of smoke and dust, the meteorite, which is the size of an island, has been pierced, disintegrated, or even shattered by hundreds of lasers. Land escape. Third Rakage's complexion changed drastically. This is the limit of blood succession of Cloud Shinobi Village. How could Ninja Shura, who was born in the Uchiha clan, master Landon? What happened? Onoki was also stunned on the spot. All the techniques of Uchiha Madara in his memory are related to Sharingan. Why did he suddenly display the land un that can only be mastered by ninjas of the lineage of Cloud Shinobi Village First Rakage? Quote dot quote. Is it because of Rinnegan? Yi Kang said in surprise. If so, that's fine. If it's not about the Rinnegan, then, there's a big problem here. Quote. Citrus Yagura stares closely at Uchiha Madara. I don't know if it's because of becoming a Jinchuriki that his intuition has become sharper than before. At the moment when Uchiha Madara casted the lantern, he involuntarily had an idea that Uchiha Madara's lantern has nothing to do with Rinnegan, but has something to do with Cloud Shinobi Village. Land Dun. After taking a full view of Uchiha Madara's Land Dun, Carl's eyes narrowed slightly. Observation hockey spread out instantly. This time, what he perceives, Li Haojiao, is not the breath, not the future, but, the voice of the heart. I see. No wonder you know how to use Land Dun, and you are still so familiar with how to use Land Dun. Feeling like you went to Cloud Shinobi Village. Quote. With a flash of red in his eyes, the doubts on Carl's face instantly disappeared, replaced by a look of clarity. Do you feel the voice of your heart? Your observation hockey is as annoying as ever. Quote. Uchiha Madara frowned. Although he has faced it many times, every time he faces Carl, he is very upset with observation hockey. Even ordinary people don't want to be prying into their hearts unscrupulously, let alone him Uchiha Madara. Chapter 167 Madara, You Steal the Land Un of First Rakage Part 1 Please Subscribe. Why is the blood succession boundary of the pupil technique, especially the Sharingan, so feared, rejected, and disgusted in the ninja world? In addition to the fact that Uchiha itself is not very pleasing, there is also the fact that Sharingan's pupil power makes people uncomfortable, and they resist from the bottom of their hearts. When facing Sharingan, many people will involuntarily develop a feeling that they can see everything through this kind of eyes. A feeling of. It's so uncomfortable just to be seen through, let alone Carl's observation hockey can directly sense the voice of the heart. Of course, so are the white eyes. It's just because the Hyuga family has very strict family education, and in Konoha, the ninja world has always adopted a low-key, neutral, and Sydney way, not as high-profile and arrogant as the Uchiha family, so the situation is much better, less targeted. Not only the major ninja villages, but also inside Konoha. No one wants to be seen through for no reason. In addition, the family's secret arts, as well as some secrets, can be easily snooped on. And Carl was born in the Sengoku era, and observation hockey was once feared by people of that era, and enjoyed more treatment than Sharingan and Supercilious. The reason why Uchiha had an enmity with Carl back then was largely because of observation hockey. What does he know about 113? Third Rakage's pupils shrank, and his hands clenched into fists. He knows that Carl's observation hockey is different from all sentient abilities in the ninja world. It can sense the breath, predict the attack, and even perceive the voice of the heart. That sentence turned out that you went to Cloud Shinobi Village, which made him, who was Rakage, very upset. 
Because in his memory, he only saw Uchiha Madara once in the Valley of the End. Sure enough, Uchiha Madara's land done really has nothing to do with Rinnegan, but, has something to do with Cloud Shinobi Village. Citrus Yagura murmured, Onoki and Hakura didn't speak, but just stared at Uchiha Madara. At this moment, four shadows realized that the ninja Shura in front of them had done many things that they didn't even know about. And these things are likely to have something to do with them. Since you have done it, why should you be afraid of being known? Carl said calmly, Afraid, am I afraid, just hate your observation hockey. It made me want to give you a surprise, but it turned out to be nothing. Uchiha Madara gave a dismissive smile. He kept it from Si Ying, not because he was afraid of Si Ying, nor because he was afraid of being found out. Just wanted to surprise his old rival Carl. However, in front of observation hockey, it was obvious that he could not achieve the effect he expected. Mr. Madara, what exactly did you do at Cloud Shinobi Village? When Third Rakage heard the conversation between Carl and Uchiha Madara, his anxiety grew stronger. Nothing, just took something I needed from First Rakage. Facing Third Rakage's questioning, Uchiha Madara said with a blank face. His tone was very flat, even indifferent. Only those who are contemptuous from the heart and don't take Third Rakage or even way in village in their eyes at all will have this kind of tone. You, B asterisk 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 D, how dare you desecrate the body of Master First Rakage? The old man was very strange just now, even if it is land done. But this usage is so familiar, in the ninja world, only Master First Rakage knows it, but you have mastered it. So that's what happened, it was you, you stole the First Rakage's land done. Third Rakage was so excited that roaring thunder spewed out from his whole body. Calm down, Shadow, Onogi flew over and held down third generation, BF to Rakage with all his might. Onoki boy, are you sure you want to hold him? When Carl said this, Onoki's expression froze. You, what do you mean? Onoki turned his head a little stiffly. You don't think Madara only went to Cloud Shinobi Village once, do you? Are you questioning me? Although the corpses and traces can be destroyed directly, the power of the first generation cage is so coveted that no cage from Ninja Village is willing to destroy their corpses. As soon as the words came out, Yagura was glad that his first Mizukage lived again not long ago, but was killed by Carl. This respect, I hope Mr. Madara can keep us. Just like the corpse of Senju Hashirama, Senju Tobarama holds a big secret and needs to be carefully guarded. Carl admired Onoki whose expression gradually became the same as that of third rakage with a half smile. After all, we are also in the same camp. The other first generation level cages are all existences above the contemporary five cages, and there are countless secrets in the corpses. If it wasn't for the big enemy, if it wasn't for Uchiha Madara to counter Carl, just because Uchiha Madara made some small moves against first generation without telling them would be enough for them to turn their faces. Don't dare, it's just about our ninja village's first generation shadow, I think Mr. Madara, you have to tell us. In the face of Uchiha Madara's unreasonable and strong oppression, although the faces of the three Onoki were as dark as the bottom of the pot, their tone softened. Otherwise, I guess I would be as pale as Onoki, third rakage, and two Kang at this time. Mr. Madara, I think it is very necessary for you to tell us, what exactly did you do to our ninja village's first generation shadow? Uchiha Madara glanced condescendingly at Onoki, first rakage, and Hakura. This also led to the fact that after the death of the shadows of the major ninja villages, there was no way to bury them, they could only be sealed and protected, and of course they had to be studied. Third rakage, Onoki, and Hakura stared at Uchiha Madara coldly. Under the triple suppression of powerful momentum, evil pupil power, and surging chakra, the arrogance of the three shadows was instantly suppressed. And you, Kei's cage who has never met before, do you think Madara has ever been to Sunagakar? Chapter 168 Madara who gathers first generation thunder, earth, wind, shadow and heart, part 2 more subscription required. HMPH, this is the tone you should have when talking to me. Seeing that Sankage's tone had softened, Uchiha Madara snorted coldly just now, and then his light tone made Sankage, and even the ninjas of the four villages alliance army's face changed drastically. Since you want to know so much, I might as well tell you directly. Before coming, I took first Rakage, first Tsuchikage, and first generation Kei's, Kage's heart. His words stunned sighing, and Konoha F4, Sanin and others looked at him in disbelief. To poach the heart of other people's predecessor Hokage, and still be so righteous, so natural, this kind of thing can only be done by Feng Zivo Madara in the ninja world. You, you be asterisk 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 d. The three of Onogi came back to their senses, and they immediately gritted their teeth. Don't use this expression, it's just a few dead people. Even if I don't take their hearts away, aren't you younger generations still studying their corpses every day and night, trying to steal their power? You are angry, it's not that I desecrated their corpses, but that I took away the power that you couldn't obtain after years of research. Uchiha Madara saw the reason for Sankage's righteous indignation at a glance, and it was exactly the same, he dismissed Sankage. You should think this way, I have the power of the first generation three shadows, and the chances of defeating Karl are even higher. How to put it, the four shadows of first generation are all defeated by Karl. They must really want to beat Karl once. Now their hearts are on me, if I win Karl, in a sense, the three of them win Karl, as the descendants of first generation, you should be happy, right? When Uchiha said this, there was a hint of playfulness on his face. 
You, hearing this, even Onoki, the deepest man in the city, turned pale with anger, and chakra surged out of his body, as if he was about to strike. The same is true for third rakage and Yi Kang on the side. As the shadow of Ninja Village, Uchiha Madara spoke out about poaching the heart of the first generation shadow in full view, and she was so arrogant and domineering. If they didn't express it at all, they probably wouldn't have the chance to do this shadow again. What? Want to do it with me? Remember that time I said to Rakage earlier? Better think clearly, you only get one chance. If you really want to replace Carl as my warm-up partner, then I don't mind giving it to you. Quote. Facing the aura exuded by the three shadows and chakra, Uchiha Madara's face remained unchanged, but Sharingan burst out with a cold killing intent. You. Three. Calm down, the situation is the most important thing. Just when Sankage was about to go berserk at Uchiha Madara's words, Yagura, who was the only one who was still calm, stepped forward to persuade him. Hateful. Third Rakage glanced at Ai who was nailed to the stone statue, his breath getting weaker and weaker. Damn Uchiha Madara, Onoki thought of the dead Huang too, and immediately forcibly suppressed the anger in his heart. Sooner or later, I will settle this account with him. Yi Kang glanced at the group of San Shinobi behind him. Is this just a measure? If you had fought with me just now, then I, Madara, might still give you a high look. It's a pity that it's such a time, and you guys don't even have the courage to fight with me. Quote. Uchiha Madara saw that Sankage Onoki couldn't hold back his anger, and the disdain in Sharingan became stronger. Rakage, don't forget your son is still on it. However, in the face of his ridicule, except for the fact that third Rakage almost lost control, Yi Kang and Onoki, who had already forced themselves to calm down, were silent, although their faces were gloomy. Ask for flowers. The old man knows what to do. Third Rakage forcefully pressed the lightning-style chakra back into his body. After Yi Kang and the others saw that third Rakage had finally stopped the rampage, they also breathed a sigh of relief. Carl, I've let you down. Uchiha Madara ignored sighing, who was furious but could only forcefully endure, and turned to look at Carl. Why do you say that? Carl looked at Uchiha Madara a little surprised. The farce you imagined didn't happen. Even if sighing knew that I dug their graves and took away their hearts, they still didn't dare to do anything with me. Originally wanted to see a joke, but couldn't see it, aren't you disappointed? Uchiha Madara said word by word. At the end of the crane, your fantasy ability is too rich. It doesn't matter if you beat you or see your jokes, why should I use the hands of others? Carl grinned. This is the last time you will call me by that name. In Uchiha Madara's eyes, the three fast rotating black hook jades have been connected into a line, turning into the pattern of eternal Mangekyo Sharingan Sharingan. Whether it is the number one hero of Sengoku or the ranking of the three heroes of Sengoku, these are all old and outdated things. It is also time to conform to the changing times and reinvent the system. I, Uchiha Madara, I will reset the rankings of you, me, and Hashirama today. As soon as the voice fell, Uchiha Madara raised his hand and wiped in midair. Call out. At the same time as the bright blue light burst out, hundreds of blue laser bombs poured down, covering the entire ending valley. Chapter 169 Fierce Battle. Heroes and Shura, subscription required for the third update. Quick. Get ready for Earth Style. Sarutobi Hirazan saw that Uchiha Madara didn't move, and that he brought the entire valley of the end, and even many Konoha Shinobi fighters into the attack range, and immediately yelled sharply. Land done of this scale. Can't go wrong. That damn B asterisk 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 D Uchiha Madara really took Lord First Rakage's Landon. Only Lord First Rakage's Landon can do this. If it was normal, Third Rakage must be very happy to see so many Konoha Shinobi being attacked by Landon, but now the expression on his face is as ugly as that of Jay Shang. Even if First Rakage stands in front of the old man and uses Landon, it will have no effect, not to mention that you, 307, just stole the power of First Rakage. However, in the face of Uchiha Madara's overwhelming laser bombs, Carl just raised his right hand lightly, and Armament Haki evolved into a huge invisible defensive wall. All the falling laser bombs, like the falling stars, melted into the air one by one like ice and snow that had encountered a raging fire when they touched the defensive wall formed by armament hockey. Land done is just a weapon. How powerful it can be depends on the user. Although it is true that I stole the power of first rakage, it does not mean that I cannot use land done better than him. As soon as Uchiha Madara finished speaking, the person had turned into a blue beam and disappeared from Seven Tails Chome's head. Call out. At the same time, a blue flash suddenly flashed from behind Carl. Land done light transformation. Before the people present could react, Uchiha Madara had already stepped out of the blue light. No, it should be said that the blue light turned into Uchiha Madara's appearance, and then carried a penetrating power stronger than lightning style chakra, kicked kicks at Carl. Close to hand combat with the old man. Madara, you are really floating. It seems that the hearts of the three first generation shadows have made you forget the scars you had back then. Facing Uchiha Madara, who was faster than lightning, Carl raised his hand and hit his elbow directly on Uchiha Madara's foot, like a prophet. Boom. As the fists and feet of the two intersected, a majestic shock wave suddenly surged in the sky above the valley of the end. The group of Konoha shinobi below had to back away. After all, the loud noise produced by the collision of the fists and feet of the two has already made the eardrums of many ninjas unbearable. Even with the protection of chakra, the heavy explosion just now still shook the ears of the nearby Konoha shinobi. Not to mention that a physical collision between Karl and Uchiha Madara created a terrifying shock wave. 
Observation hockey is really troublesome. Uchiha Madara's eyes narrowed slightly. With the help of Black Zetsu, after giving up the hearts of Uchiha Shisui and Uchiha Fugaku, and choosing the heart of First Rakage sealed by Cloud Shinobi Village, what he got was not just as simple as Landun. With his talent, relying on the heart of First Rakage, he not only stole Landun, but also Water Style and Lightning Style are no less than First Rakage, of course he also has physical skills. After Landun's enhanced physical skills, he even has the confidence to cooperate with Eternal Mangekio Sharingan to compete with Carl. However, in the current collision, Carl not only accepted his Landun and Jutsu, but even made his right foot ache. That's it. Carl glanced at Uchiha Madara, who was close at hand, and elbowed back. Boom. Like a torrent pouring down, and a terrifying force like Mount Tai pressing down on the top, Uchiha Madara tried his best to resist, but his body turned into a blasting shell uncontrollably, and instantly flew out of the sky of the Valley of the End, ten heads fell on the river hundreds of meters away. Hello, are you ready? Madara. When the word Madara was uttered from Carl's mouth, he had disappeared above the head of the stone statue, and appeared like a ghost on the river where Uchiha Madara fell down. Land done Amazon Cloud Sword. Although Uchiha Madara did not have observation hockey, but after being knocked into the air just now, Eternal Mangekio Sharingan has been keeping a close eye on Carl's. Almost at the same time when Carl dodged and moved, he who was landed on the river had turned over and stood up. At the same time, his left hand was in a seal, and between the five fingers of his right hand, a blue lightsaber had fallen into his hand, and then he fell down. And stabbed on the ground. Clang. It was clear that Carl's right foot was only flesh and blood, but when it collided with the blue lightsaber in Uchiha Madara's hand, there was a piercing sound of gold and iron clashing. Not only that, the feet and swords of the two collided, and the water in the river suddenly surged, as if dozens of mist shinobi Jonin had jointly cast water-style water barrier. The huge water flow was affected by the power of the two, and with a bang, it rose into the sky and turned into a huge and incomparable water column. It's good to get 5.1. Carl stepped on the blue lightsaber Uchiha Madara held in his right hand. As he continued to increase his strength, even if Uchiha Madara, who could still hold the sword, changed to holding the sword with both hands, his body continued to sink in the river. Not only that, his knees were also gradually bending. Damn it, it's stronger than ever. After getting the heart of first rakage, even if I use Lantern Ninjutsu and Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, can't I compete with this guy Carl? Uchiha Madara frowned slightly. Although it was just a warm-up, he did not allow himself to be at a disadvantage, let alone being trampled to the ground by Carl. Chapter 170 Madara, are you planning to re-rank the ranking with your mouth? The fourth update asks for subscription. Madara, an era is gone, just this little difference. Are you going to use your lips to re-rank the rankings? Just when Uchiha Madara was amazed by Carl's strength, Carl's right foot, who was stepping on the blue laser sword, sank suddenly. Chi Chi. There was a deafening bang, and at the same time a surging sound visible to the naked eye, centered on Uchiha Madara's blue laser sword at Carl's heel, blue-black lightning flashed in all directions one after another like streamers in flowing water. Come. The ground the two stepped on continued to collapse meter by meter, and at the same time, the huge collapsed pit continued to expand in all directions. Just the collision between Taijutsu and Ninjutsu, the aftermath of the power that the two radiate is already comparable to A-level, no, it is the power of ordinary S-level esoteric Ninjutsu. What's the rush? It's just a warm-up. What's more, the battle is not about whoever is stronger as the winner. Uchiha Madara watched Carl getting closer and closer to him, pressing his blue laser sword to collapse fifteen right feet, Eternal Mangekio Sharingan turned around suddenly. Call out. His body spread apart in an instant, like photons gathering and dispersing randomly, and disappeared in place in an instant. Originally, as his body suddenly disappeared, Carl's right foot would inevitably step on the air. However, at the same time when he disappeared, Carl was like a prophet. On the stairs, with the help of his right foot, his body also disappeared in place. Bang bang bang. Almost at the moment when the two disappeared at the same time, air fluctuations burst out one after another in a thousand meter radius, and shocking cracks extended out on the ground. The valley of the end, no, it is the sky of Konoha Forest, which has been covered with thick layers of dark clouds unknowingly. The celestial phenomena are being rewritten at an astonishing speed under the influence of the two people's wanton swaying power. The fourth ninja war was promised, but now it has become a duet between the hero and Uchiha Madara. The two corners of the battlefield are being divided, and the Konoha side and the four villages are facing each other. At this time, they can only be reduced to a foil and an audience on the stage. Whether Konoha F4, Sanin, Seekage, or Jinchuriki, every time they have the idea of fighting, they will be killed by themselves as soon as they see Carl and Uchiha Madara's fists colliding. Whether it's Uchiha Madara's speed above the lightning, or Carl's majestic power over the two eras of the ninja world, every ninja who saw this battle felt ashamed and despondent. Even if they want to get close to the battlefield, it is very difficult for them to do so, let alone participate in the battle. At this time, the allied forces of the four villages and the Konoha Shinobi want to start a war, and they can only fight by bypassing them. However, the speed and power of Carl and Uchiha Madara are extremely terrifying. Expanding, so that Konoha and the top leaders of the four village coalition can only retreat again and again. Is this an action that humans can have? After retreating one kilometer again, whether it was Third Rakage, who ruled the ninja world with his strong physique and ninjutsu before Carl and Uchiha Madara came out of the mountain, or Yekora, Yagura and Onogi beside him, their faces were all covered. Full of surprise. 
At this speed and in front of such power, any kind of ninjutsu becomes pale and powerless. Minato, can you keep up with them? Jiraiya's left and right eyes look like they can do their own thing, one eye is fixed on the heroes and Shira who are fighting fiercely, and the other eye is on Namikaze Minato beside him. Ms. Jiraiya, you are flattering me too much. Flying Thunder God is fast, but the problem is that my nerve reflexes can't keep up with these two. Facing their actions, I lost within ten encounters. Quote. Namikaze Minato smiled wryly upon hearing this. In front of the physical skills of these two people, I, the number one ninja in the ninja world, is simply a joke. Of course, this refers to the situation of fighting, just like in the Fourth World War, he used Flying Thunder God plus Rasengan to attack Uchiha Madara, but was almost beaten to death by Uchiha Madara. If it is to fly farther than anyone else, space ninjutsu such as Flying Thunder God still has an advantage. After all, whether it is Karl or Uchiha Madara, no matter how fast they are, it is impossible for them to be like space-time ninjutsu, from the extreme south of the ninja world to the extreme north 270 within 10 seconds. You kid still wants to hide your clumsiness in front of me. Don't think I don't know, you have practiced sage mode. Doesn't it work even if sage mode is turned on? Although Jiraiya was mentally prepared, she couldn't help but click her tongue secretly when she heard Namikaze Minato's words. After all, his disciple's speed is known as the number one in the ninja world, of course before he met Carl. So what? It takes a certain amount of time to prepare to use sage mode with the amount of my chakra, and it doesn't make much sense in battle. Even if they would give me time to prepare for sage mode, it would still be pointless. Not only do they simply explode fast in a straight line, but they can also maintain this extreme speed for high-intensity battles. What's even more frightening is that the attack speed, frequency, and non-human strength of the two of them are extremely powerful, horrible. Teacher Jiraiya, what do you think will happen if I get rubbed by the two of them? Namikaze Minato spread his hands, with a dumbfounded expression. Chapter 171 No Four Wars, Only Carl and Madara's Dance, Part 5 Please Subscribe. Jiraiya was silent, and so were the two toads standing on his shoulders. Indeed, simply keeping up with the speed of Carl and Uchiha Madara in an instant, if the physical fitness, strength, attack frequency, etc. cannot keep up, it is still the White Tower. After all, it's a life and death fight now, not a 100 meter sprint. Kashina, what about you? Turn on Karama mode, you should be able to touch them a few times. Hearing Namikaze Minato's words, Tsunade couldn't help but look at Uzumaki Kashina. In her opinion, Konoha's current top player should be Uzumaki Kashina who has activated Karama mode with the help of Karl. Master Tsunade, don't you think that your question is a bit wrong? You should ask me, if I fight Uncle Karl and Uchiha Madara, how many seconds will I last before I die? Uzumaki Kashina looked at Tsunade like an idiot. Karama mode is strong and completely beyond the realm of human beings. Even the third Rakage, who was previously called a monster, can knock it to the ground and explode with a hammer, but the question is which of the two fighting Karl and Uchiha Madara is a normal human being? The Fourth Ninja World War. It would be more appropriate to say that it is the battle between heroes and Shira. Sarutobi Hiruzen took a look at the fight, even if it was just a warm-up battle between Karl and Uchiha Madara, but still felt a bit disheartened. The victory or defeat of Arkonaha and four village ninja alliance is not at all on each other, but on the two of them. Uchiha Fugaku sighed heavily. Indeed, so what if we lose to the allied forces of four villages? As long as Sir Karl defeats Uchiha Madara, with a few punches, it would be great if 3,000 of the coalition forces of the 34,000 villages can survive. The existence of the two of them can not only change the terrain of the ninja world at will, but also change the outcome of a ninja world war at will. Hehe, <laughs> there really isn't any four wars, if there is, it's just a dance between Iron Fist and Shira. Nara Shirju, Hayuga Hiyashi and others beside him couldn't help saying bitterly when they heard this. Even Shimura Danzo, who always looked at Uchiha extremely disliked, acquiesced to Uchiha Fugaku's words at this time. Uchiha Madara, seems to be going downhill. Immortal Zima suddenly opened his toad eyes. Although it is small in size, its strength is not weak at all. The most important thing is that she has been cultivating for hundreds of years in Mount Mayoboku, a place rich in natural energy, for hundreds of years. She has excellent control over natural energy. Although the eyes and nerve reflexes can't keep up with the speed of Karl and Uchiha Madara, they can barely perceive the changes in the battle situation when they use their perception ability to watch from a distance. The winner will be decided so soon. When Jiraiya heard this, she quickly turned her head and asked. Nearby F4, Dada and others all looked at Immortal Shima. Apparently, none of them expected that the situation of the battle would change so quickly. They originally thought that evenly matched forces would last for a long time. After all, the last two recorded battles of the three masters in the ninja village era, the battle between the hero and the god of ninja, and the battle between the god of ninja and Shira of the ninja world have been fought for several days. What are you thinking, little Jiraiya? This is just a physical battle, or a warm-up for the two of them. Quote. Immortal Zima said unhappily, it's just a way for them to see how much each other has changed over the years. Don't forget, Uchiha Madara has been only using Eternal Mangekio Sharingan's Insight and First Rakage's Landun, the other two first generation Shadow Heart abilities, Eternal Mangekio Sharingan's Pupil Technique, and even the Uchiha family's Fire Style, etc. are all useless. When F4, Sanin, Four Shadows and other powerhouses saw Karl's figure clearly, they immediately gasped in shock. 
Witnessing that Carl blasted Uchiha Madara into the deep pit, but he was not damaged, not even the slightest crease in the clothes, and even the breathing has been steady, without the slightest rush, every ninja felt scalp tingling. Immortal Shen Zuo explained, Sure enough, the martial arts and ninja world is so big that no one can compete with heroes. As an old toad who has lived for hundreds of years, his knowledge, vision, and experience are all here. Is Uchiha Madara, this kind of physical ability like a perpetual motion machine is simply beyond their understanding of the human body. Boom. Of course, Carl is also useless, after all, until now, he is purely using his body to fight, and he doesn't even use the six moves, let alone hockey. Everyone looked around and saw the slightly embarrassed figure of Uchiha Madara lying in the deep pit right now. On the contrary, Carl, Li Jiaohao, the leader of the three heroes, landed lightly on the edge of the deep pit. Simply a monster. Also, his breathing is also very smooth, as if the battle just now was just a stroll in the park for him, what a terrifying physical ability. With the dust flying all over the sky, a huge pit with a diameter of hundreds of meters was smashed out abruptly. Even if you stole the first Rakage's land done, Shira is still defeated. After such a high-intensity battle, it's okay that he wasn't injured, and even his clothes weren't damaged at all. The purpose of releasing the Buddha was to confirm the words of the two toad sages. Just after the words of the two toads fell, there was a loud noise on the battlefield. They were horrified by the scene. I saw a black shadow, like a rapidly falling comet, slamming down on the ground at an astonishing speed from a height of hundreds of meters. Chapter 172 First Tsuchikage Shihei's Blood Inheritance Boundary Part 6 Please Subscribe. UV asterisk 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 D, the fist is really heavy. They are obviously very old, but their fist strength is heavier than when they were young. It's really as strong as a monster. Uchiha Madara was lying in the deep pit, although he grinned embarrassingly for a while, but the unruly and confident face on his face did not diminish in the slightest. His appearance made the surrounding ninjas have an illusion for a while, as if the person who was beaten and lying in the pit was not him at all. It's been a long time since I've moved my body like this, but it's still fun to play with you and Hashirama. Although Bai Lien and the others are not bad, they are not interesting after all. Quote. Carl glanced at Uchiha Madara who was still lying in the pit, and grinned softly. Well, how long are you going to lie there? Back then, you were more than capable. After so many years, if you don't believe me, you only have this level. If so, then you are too sorry for the hearts of first generation I, Lido and Shihi. Uchiha Madara couldn't help laughing at his words. Haha, am I doing this for your own good? Now lie down a little longer, and you'll never have a chance to remember that feeling of having the upper hand. Enjoy the last 863 minutes of your time above me. From now on, you can only chase after me, Madara. Uchiha Madara laughed wildly and stood up from the pit, then pointed to his back. Here we go again, Madara, what you say will make the old man feel very distressed. If it weren't for the fact that there are so many people here, so many pairs of eyes watching and spreading the word, others would think that you can really beat the old man. Carl pressed his forehead with a helpless expression. Don't think, it will soon become a hall. Otherwise, what do you think I built this stage and prepared so many audiences for? As Uchiha Madara said, BFBG untied the red armor on his body. The second round, is about to begin. After he finished speaking, the red armor on his body fell to the ground. Ro, the smile on Carl's face remained unchanged, but he took off his cloak like Uchiha Madara, but instead of throwing it on the ground, he waved his hand and threw the cloak in the direction of the Valley of the End. Uzumaki Kashina, who has been closely watching his every move, has a bright eye, stretched out his right hand, and Chakra's hand flew a hundred meters away in an instant, grabbing Carl's cloak before Tsunade. Sorry, Master Tsunade, you have been ahead of me so many times, but it's time for me to lead once. Kashina turned her head and glanced at Tsunade, with a fox-like snicker on her pretty face. Is this what your Karama mode is for? Tsunade was not dissatisfied, but made fun of Uzumaki Kashina. After all, they are all involved in the Ninja World War, and they are not 16 or 17 year old girls. Naturally, it is impossible for them to become jealous or lose their mentality because of this matter. Don't worry about it, as long as it works. Seeing Tsunade smiling, Uzumaki Kashina felt like punching the air. If you like to take it, then take it. As far as I know, this cape has special meaning to Carl Uncle. But don't lose it, and don't break it. Quote. The corners of Tsunade's mouth twitched slightly. How could she not know Uzumaki Kashina's little thought? Special significance. Uzumaki Kashina first glanced down at the cloak in his hand, and then couldn't help asking. In the ninja world, information is very valuable. Didn't you turn on Karama mode? You can investigate by yourself. After Tsunade finished speaking, he ignored Uzumaki Kashina and looked straight towards the battlefield. What an air. I don't believe it. Konoha is only known to master Tsunade. Uzumaki Kashina was a little upset. She was a little depressed to be aroused by her curiosity, but then put it aside. Why is it that I am clearly ahead, but it seems that I am behind? By the way, you can ask Nine Tails. Thinking of this, Uzumaki Kashina's eyes lit up. Just when she sneaked into the sealed space and wanted to ask Nine Tails if she knew the origin of the cloak in her hand, Carl and Uchiha Madara, who had already taken off their cloak and armor on the battlefield, had already started the second round. Rock escaped super gravity. Uchiha Madara didn't make a seal, just raised his foot and stepped on the pit. Boom. 
The gravity within a range of hundreds of meters, or even nearly a thousand meters, changes instantaneously, becoming extremely heavy. The fallen leaves that were originally flying became many times heavier, and it seemed that the gravitational force was strengthened a lot, and they fell to the ground in an instant. Click. Soon, even Buddha couldn't bear the heavy ground, and began to crack huge cracks. And Carl, who is within the range of gravity, feels that in the depths of the ninja world, there seems to be infinite gravity pulling him, which makes him work many times harder than usual with one finger. This is, Lord Ishikawa pacified the land of the land and founded Iwagakur's rock dungeon. In the distance, Onoki Fangfo, who was outside the battlefield, noticed something, and that old face was instantly filled with horror. The names of the five major ninja villages all have important origins. It's not that the ninjas in Ninja Village are named casually. Just like the wooden characters in Kanahagakur are derived from the wood style of first Hokage Senju Hashirama, the rock characters in Iwagakur are also derived from the unique blood succession boundary of first Tsuchikage Shihei. Rock Escape, Chapter 173 It's not the blood successor who can't do it, it's Shihei who can't do it Part 1 Please subscribe. Not only the land done of first Rakage, but also the rock done of first Tsuchikage. Although Uchiha Madara is using rock done at this time, third Rakage's face is still very ugly. This guy has not only mastered the first generation three shadows technique, but also used it very well, he is no longer inferior to Shodai and the others. Citrus Yagura has personally seen the blood succession limit of first Mizukage White Lotus. That is simply comparable to the destructive power of a tailed beast. However, Uchiha Madara's current Lantern and Yantan are not at all inferior to the style of first Mizukage, and even worse. You guys don't forget. Until now, Uchiha Madara is only using the first generation three shadows jutsu, his own jutsu, neither Eternal Mangekyo Sharingan nor Rinnegan are using it. As soon as Yi Kang said this, the other three shadows felt extremely complicated. They hoped that Uchiha Madara would be stronger, preferably able to beat Carl, but they were also worried that Uchiha Madara was too strong. After all, judging from Uchiha Madara's attitude towards them just now, once Carl is defeated, the fate of the three shadows will not be much better, right? However, the battle of the three heroes after an era has already begun. At this time, no matter how regretful Sighing is, he can only watch and cooperate. There is no other way. Third Mizukage, is this what you said without the first generation level shadow protection, Ninja Village doesn't even have the ability to protect itself. Hehe, <laughs> that's really true. If Hakuren Sama is still alive, even if he is not Uchiha Madara's opponent, he will not be so unscrupulous, stepping on Karigakur recklessly. At this time, Yagura couldn't help thinking of Third Mizukage's last words, and his heart became heavier. Is it the rock escape of Shihei? I really didn't expect that after his guy died under the fist of the old man, there is still a chance to see him. Carl's eyes flickered slightly in the hypergravity space. Yan Dun. Of course he is familiar with it. After all, Shihei relied on Yandan who tampered with gravity with one hand at the beginning, so he escaped from him all the way to Iwagakur and was chased to the door by him before killing him. Very familiar. Shihei's Yandan is a ninja who conquers all physical arts, including you, Carl. Although he died under your fist back then, it's not that Yan Dun couldn't do it, it's just that he is not as good as you. Uchiha Madara raised his right hand while speaking. Look at what you said, you seem to be able to defeat the old man with the rock escape. Carl looked at Uchiha Madara blankly. You're not wrong at all. After Uchiha Madara finished speaking, he pressed his right hand down suddenly. This is a better way to use rock escape. The original gravity within a range of nearly a kilometer has been rewritten, but under the control of Uchiha Madara, the gravity space is infinitely reduced, and it only acts on Carl alone, instead of affecting a hundred days. However, although gravity is only acting on Carl, the multiplier of gravity is higher than before. It's not over yet. While admiring Carl's appearance of being trapped by gravity, Uchiha Madara opened his right hand, and with five fingers gently clenched, his entire arm was covered by hot magma, and purple light visible to the naked eye circled around the entire body. On the magma arm. The fluctuation of gravity and the scorching air waves mixed together, instantly causing the air on the battlefield to appear viscous and distorted. The ninja watching the battle from a distance, just seeing this picture, can already imagine the horror of this punch without Uchiha Madara's shot. Carl, see that, this is me now, this is your opponent now. Now, do you still dare to say that you can defeat me? Uchiha Madara raised his magma arm, and the arrogance on his face became more and more intense. Damn it, not just Yantan, even Shihei Sama's another kind of blood successor ghost, lava style Uchiha Madara, has also mastered it. Asking for flowers, Onoki's face is as black as the bottom of a pot. Let alone Yan Dun, like Senju Hashirama's wood style, Iwagakur has been lost since Iwagakur's death. But Lava Style has a ninja handed down, and this person is standing by his side. Four Tails Jinchuriki Old Purple. It's just that he can tell at a glance that compared with Uchiha Madara's Lava Style, Laozi's Lava Style is like the gap between Firewood and Prairie Fire. He can actually direct gravity as he likes, and even played a compound blood successor just like by Lien. This guy Madara's brain is really good at fighting. After taking a panoramic view of Uchiha Madara's operation, the doctor didn't smile back. Zero. Whether it's directing gravity, or the fusion of blood succession boundary, he has to admit that Uchiha Madara's use of rock done is indeed better than Stone River. Compound blood successor Magma Fist Tiger. Uchiha Madara saw that Carl didn't show the slightest shock on his face, and he yelled out of displeasure, and blatantly struck out the Magma Fist entwined with gravity fluctuations. 
Boom. Under the sound of thunder and rolling, his gravitational magma fist was like a volcano erupting, and the magma spewed out, expanding nearly ten times in an instant, and then directly bombarded Carl's body with a terrifying impact. The gravity that overwhelms everything, the magma that burns everything, and the impact of the magma fist like a volcanic eruption. The three forces erupted at the same time, and the space where Carl was located suddenly showed irregular distortions. The atmosphere of the Buddha ninja world, no, even the space can't bear Uchiha Madara's compound blood successor power. Although the damage range of this punch is not particularly huge, unlike Tailed Beast Bomb, which can level several mountains or flatten a city, its absolute destructive power is better than that of ordinary Tailed Beast Bomb. Even more terrifying. Just the space where Carl is, presenting a kaleidoscopic distortion, has already made every ninja who sees this picture break out in cold sweat and feel terrified. Chapter 174 The Three Shadows of the First Generation's Five Blood Succession Power Part 2 Subscribe As this punch a human can catch. Konoha F4 Sanin, Four Shadows, and even Uzumaki Kashina with Kurama mode turned on couldn't help but come up with this idea. It's no wonder they thought so, it's because Uchiha Madara's punch was too frightening. The scope of destruction is not large, but the visual impact is extremely terrifying. Under one punch, the atmosphere and space of the Buddha become like dough, which is randomly rounded and flattened by Uchiha Madara. Anyone who sees it can't help feeling desperate. Chi Chi. Just when all the ninjas were shocked by Uchiha Madara's punch, a palm-like hand suddenly protruded from the twisted magma, and grabbed Uchiha Madara's gravity magma fist. Carl. Watching. 20-0. To this scene, Uchiha Madara's eternal Mangekio Sharingan shrank slightly. This punch was already close to his ultimate under normal circumstances. But it seems that it is still difficult to shake this man. Boom. As if to prove his idea, when Carl's right hand stretched out from the gravitational magma, and then pulled to the side, Uchiha Madara, who originally thought that this blow would give Carl a little surprise, sank, and his feet were not affected. He took a step aside in a controlled manner. Gravity magma punch, and himself were just grabbed by Carl, pulled off, and pulled aside. At this time, Carl, who was engulfed by the magma, appeared again in the eyes of the world. Not bad. Whether it is Lan Dun, Yan Dun, or Lava Style, they are all better than first generation I and Shihi. I have to praise you for this. But if you say you can defeat the old man, you are taking it for granted, Madara. Carl turned his head slightly, glanced at Uchiha Madara, and then plunged five claw-like fingers into the magma. A streak of black lightning is like a python, winding and hovering above the magma fist. In the next second, black light flashed out, whether it was gravity fluctuations or magma punches, they all exploded. Then add this, Uchiha Madara held his right hand, and the blue light flashed, and Landon Chakra turned into a laser sword. Yan Dun and Lava Style Chakra surged out, and the moment they were wrapped around the laser sword, he suddenly raised the sword forward and slashed down angrily. Click. Where the sword pointed, the atmosphere rolled and twisted like noodles, and sometimes folded in half like white paper. The deep pit that was smashed out by Uchiha Madara just now shattered a chasm tens of meters deep and 200 meters long. Under the impact of his power, the thick and solid surface melted away. Although Landon, Yandan, and Lava Style are not fused at all, but superimposed on each other in the form of compound ninjutsu, their power is extremely terrifying. In the eyes of all ninjas, Uchiha Madara at this time is like a god who manipulates the natural forces of the ninja world at will. With every gesture, several blood powers burst out. Not so good, however, in the face of Uchiha Madara's sword that combined the power of the three blood successors, Carl just punched out, distorting the atmosphere, and the oncoming laser sword, all of which were blown into pieces in an instant. The scene that became extremely strange due to the power of the three blood successors disappeared instantly. Uchiha Madara let out a muffled grunt. Before he could stabilize his body, Carl had already stepped forward, like a flying thunder god who didn't need a wooden pose as a coordinate, and appeared out of nowhere in front of Uchiha Madara who hadn't stabilized his body, and raised his hand to punch him. Rock Escape Gravity Command, Uchiha Madara's face sank slightly, and a masked monster stretched out from behind. Apparently, this is the monster that has the heart of first Suchikage Shihei. It is also because of the existence of this masked monster that he does not need seals at all, and he can use the rock escape to manipulate gravity unscrupulously, and it only acts on Carl, and will not affect himself. Affected by the gravity of the crazy climb, Carl's punching speed was affected, and he gave a sudden pause. Lava style great eruption, scorch style scorching ocean. Taking advantage of the moment when Carl's punching speed slowed down, two arms formed by earth grievances stretched out from behind Uchiha Madara again. Compound blood successor hyphenation point scorching ocean great eruption. One arm ignited hot magma, and the other arm rose like a flame, like the breath of a heat wave, and then the two arms were entangled together, and they bombarded Carl's chest fiercely like a cannonball. Boom. Magnet style the hand of the crane. The curling hot air rose up, directly evaporating the river in the nearby woodleaf forest, and burning countless trees into coke. The second arm turned into the hand of guarding the crane with great sealing power. It's not over yet, Carl. The third arm became an ape-like lava fist. Scorch style oversteam kill, land done bright fang. The fourth arm wraps itself in rings of gravity waves that distort the atmosphere. Five escapes Dalian ball technique. Rock 3.4 escape gravity fist. Lava style dark monkey. Combining the power of lava style and scorch style, the sun-like magma fireball instantly filled the huge crater that Uchiha Madara smashed just now. 
The first arm shoots a blue laser that goes through everything. The temperature of the fifth arm climbed to a point higher than magma. This is the five blood successor bomb of the three shadows of the first generation that I prepared for you. Except for the Hyuga tribe who opened their eyes and the ninjas with powerful perception, no one has ever seen Uchiha Madara's body stretch out in the magma fireball whose temperature is high enough to instantly melt rocks and steel into juice. Five ministers formed by many black lines of grievances and grievances. Five arms, each carrying a kind of blood succession ninjutsu. And these five arms, five kinds of blood successor powers are under the control of Uchiha Madara at the same time, bombarded on Carl's majestic chest like a mountain. Chapter 175 Iron Fist and Rinnegan. Part 3 asks for subscription. Withstanding so many attacks, no matter how strong this guy's physique is, he will be injured this time. In one breath, he applied the five blood successor powers of the first generation three shadows to ultimate, even reaching the point where the Serutobi clan's secret wooden Dalian bullet technique, even Uchiha Madara had to take a deep breath. It is impossible for the meridians of the human body to use chakra endlessly, let alone continuously use so many blood inheritance powers. Even if his body has been replaced by earth resentment at this time, it is no exception. Call out. But the moment Uchiha Madara breathed a sigh of relief, his eternal Mangekyo Sharingan shrank suddenly, and at the same time his body tensed up, as if trying to react, but his insight kept up, but his body couldn't. Seeing that his body was about to turn into blue photons, when he cast Land on Photon Dispersion, fifteen arms that were as black as ink and entwined with black lightning suddenly emerged from the chakra light ball formed by five kinds of blood power. He reached out and grabbed his collar. Fortunately, he stepped back in front of his body, otherwise it would not be the collar but the neck that would be caught. Carl. When Uchiha Madara's eternal Mangekyo Sharingan showed a touch of disbelief, Carl had already lifted the person with one hand, lifted his feet off the ground, and was suspended in midair. Excellent blood successor technique, it works. The moment Uchiha Madara was lifted up, the chakra ball of light covering the entire pit dissipated with a bang. F4, Sanin, Uzumaki Kashina, Saiyan and others who couldn't see the situation of the battle at first stared like bull's eyes. Seeing Uchiha Madara being twisted into the air by Carl like a child, every pair of eyeballs was filled with astonishment that seemed substantive. UB asterisk 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 D, stop lying. Uchiha Madara opened the eternal Mangekyo Sharingan and glanced around, not knowing what he saw, and his face looked very ugly. Our ancestors of Uchiha are so embarrassed. The most difficult thing to accept is the many Uchiha tribes headed by Uchiha Fugaku. Although they knew that Carl had defeated Uchiha Madara many times, they never imagined that they would see Hakiza inspiring Uchiha Madara in such a state of embarrassment in this battle. It's strange, I remember Uchiha Madara. He just used Land Dun to turn his body into light, why was he lifted into midair this time, but didn't use this technique? Uchiha Shisui frowned, not caring about wasting chakra, and directly drew three Tomo Sharingan to open Mangekyo Sharingan. But after opening Mangekyo, he didn't see anything. Didn't find anything wrong. Don't worry about it, Uchiha family kid, it's impossible to see Carl's armed color with your half-baked Mangekyo pupil power. That guy's armament hockey can not only evolve substantive attack and defense, but also be released externally, and can be hidden invisible after being released externally. As far as I know, there were only two people in the Sengoku era who could see this kind of hockey. Immortal Zima's voice suddenly came. Two people. Hearing this, not only Uchiha Shisui, but everyone else pricked up their ears. One is the ancestor of the Hyuga family, Hyuga Tenen. He was also the first to see Carl Armament hockey with the power of his white eyes. One is the Uchiha Madara in front of you, but you can only open it if you activate Mangekyo Sharingan. As for you, just the pupil power of Mangekyo Sharingan is not enough to fully perceive this kind of hockey. Although, after Uchiha Fugaku told him about armament hockey before, he was basically sure that his blindness was caused by armament hockey, but it was only a guess after all. The moment black lightning burst out and wrapped around his entire arm, his fist had already hit Uchiha in front of him. His pupil power is not as good as that of Uchiha Madara, so when he casts Distinguished Heavenly Gods, he can't see the armament hockey released by Carl at all, and they collide fiercely. Sento Fukasaku glanced at Uchiha Shisui's Mangekyo Sharingan. K. Zima's words turned his guess into reality. Shinluo Tianzheng. No wonder when I used Distinguished Heavenly Gods on him, I almost lost one eye in a daze. No wonder after Uchiha Madara was brought up by Mr. Carl, he seemed to be at a loss, and didn't use Gang Dun Light Transformation at all. Boom. Thinking of the power of Carl's armor, he was only grateful. Looking at the fist almost occupying the pupils, Uchiha Madara's scarlet eyes couldn't help bursting out with purple light, and then under the incredible eyes of all the Konoha Shinobi, the jade pattern of Eternal Mangekyo Sharingan disappeared, and the evil and dark pupils also disappeared. Gone, replaced by Rinnegan exuding noble, sublime pupil power. Nice to keep the Mangekyo Sharingan without going blind. At this time, when all 540 people looked at Uchiha Madara again, they also understood why this ninja Shura was lifted into the air by Carl in such a humiliating way, but he still looked helpless. You have beaten the old man so many times, it's time to be old now. Iron Fist. When Uchiha Shisui heard the words, a flash of surprise flashed in the depths of his eyes. Carl grabbed Uchiha Madara's collar with one hand and clenched his other hand into a fist. All the ninjas who were outside the battlefield immediately realized that the moment Carl punched, almost all the colors in his sight were taken away, leaving only a light black, somewhat blurry world point 176th Rinnegan. 
Not so good. The fourth update asks for subscription. His eyes. That's not the Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, but, the Rinnegan. Damn it. How could Uchiha Madara have a Rinnegan? Almost at the moment when Uchiha Madara's Eternal Mangekio Sharingan transformed into Rinnegan, all the ninjas in the audience were in an uproar except for Seekage who already knew the inside story. Rinnegan. Those are real eyes that only exist in ninja myths. It's the eyes of the Sage of Six Paths. But now, such a pair of mythical eyes actually appeared in the eye sockets of Uchiha Madara, how could this not cause a huge sensation? Did Uchiha Madara find the eyes, or is Uchiha's Sharingan somehow related to the Rinnegan? If it's the former, it's fine, if it's the latter. Uchiha has to be careful. Is Uchiha's lineage actually related to Rinnegan? Among them, F4 headed by Serutobi Hiruzen is the most deeply touched. From time to time they looked at Uchiha Madara, and from time to time looked at Uchiha Fugaku with meaningful eyes. Trouble. Leaving aside whether Sharingan has anything to do with Rinnegan, the moment Uchiha Madara showed Rinnegan, our Uchiha situation became extremely dangerous. Uchiha Fugaku and Uchiha Shisui looked at each other. Families such as Ino Shika Cho, Kurama, etc. are okay, at most they just saw fear and defense from the patriarchs of these ninja families. But Konoha F4, especially Danzo, they saw the real greed in each other's eyes. If it weren't for the fact that the fourth ninja world war is happening right now, coupled with the existence of Uchiha Madara, and Uchiha has not shown any information about Rinnegan other than Uchiha Madara for so many years, Uchiha Fugaku has no doubts about Mui F4 directly extended his hand to their Uchiha clan. Rinnegan W. Diaresis. Carl looked at Rinnegan, who was close at hand, and the overwhelming and surging repulsive force, his eyes flashed, and the majestic fist force on his fist directly surged out in midair. Boom. When the power of the iron fist and the repulsive force of Shenluo Tianzheng collided with each other, a shock wave centered on the bodies of the two of them, enough to flatten mountains, immediately swept in all directions. A deep pit with a radius of more than one kilometer abruptly appeared in the wood leaf forced under the force collision of the two people. It's not that bad either. Carl felt the repulsive force from Uchiha Madara's body, first he sneered, and then his right fist sank. Originally affected by the repulsive force, the fist that couldn't move forward at all seemed to hit the mirror with a fist. The atmosphere filled with boundless repulsive force emerged a series of shocking and strange lines, which were somewhat similar to a broken mirror. Immediately afterwards, the repulsive force surging from Uchiha Madara's body crushed him, and forced him back again. Without the resistance of the repulsive force, Carl's fist drove straight in. It hit Uchiha Madara straight. Suzano. Uchiha Madara's complexion changed drastically. The majestic blue chakra merged with the pupil power, instantly turning into a skeleton. Click. Hundreds of trees were uprooted one by one, the surrounding area changed from a forest to a sunken basin, and the originally turbulent river was cut off on the spot. For example, his body is not as strong as before. In the end, a Buddha was formed by the meteorite from outside the sky, and it seemed to be bombarded by the tailed beast bomb. The terrifying sinkhole with a radius of more than one kilometer replaced the original forest terrain. The damage caused by Carl's punch, the aftermath, and the movement has just gradually disappeared. With the help of Earth Resentment, he intercepted Nagato's vortex power, and also stole the blood successor limits of First Tsuchikage, First Rakage, and First Case Cage. With the physique of the peak period, and with the resistance of Suzano and Shinluo Tianzheng, he is confident that he will be injured at most, and he will never die on the spot. Quote dot quote. Broken a heart. Boom. Without Suzano's protection, Uchiha Madara received a solid punch, and his body burst into the air on the spot like a missile, drawing a starlight over the Konoha forest, and then flew several kilometers away. In the boundless forest of leaves. What really bothered him, and even hurt a little, was that a heart, a good one, was broken. After all, after using the earth resentment, let alone deformed, even if it is damaged, the skin can be repaired. However, what made his heart tighten for a while was that Suzano had just revealed his second form, that is, a chakra skeleton, and before he had time to become even bigger, he had already encountered Carl's heavy blows when he evolved to a higher level. The strength seems to be unprecedentedly strong, but some things that belong to him have been weakened. In the deep pit, Uchiha Madara's body and face were slightly deformed. Uchiha Madara felt a broken heart in his body, and while feeling dissatisfied, he also noticed the lack of earth grievances. With just one punch, Nuota's chakra skeleton has been shattered all over, and the huge skeleton skeleton is just like a comminuted fracture of the whole body, shattered as soon as it appeared. But he didn't care much about all of this. As Uchiha Madara's body fell, a wave-like shock wave immediately shot out towards the surroundings. Even though earth resentment can restore my youth and give me four more hearts, the body after earth resentment's transformation is not as good as my original body. Chapter 177 The three major pupil techniques can only be succumbed to the old man's fist part 5. Sure enough, it's not that my body is worse after all. If it is my body, even if it is seriously injured, as long as it does not die, then with the power of Hashirama, I can recover quickly. Unlike now, D. Yuanyu's body is so brittle, he lost a heart after being punched, which prevented me from fully enjoying myself when I danced. Quote. Uchiha Madara pouted uncomfortably, then stood up from the ground. Although he was still alive, it could even be said that he was not injured, but strictly speaking, he had already died once just now. If he didn't have four hearts, he would have gone to meet Senju Hashirama after Carl's iron fist just now. Aware of the disadvantages of land resentment, he knew that he could no longer let Carl get close to him, and he could no longer bear Carl's fist. 
Otherwise, even if he still has four hearts, he will be gone after being punched four times. It seems that Rinnegan is the main dish you carefully prepared for this old man, and it is because of these eyes that you have the courage to challenge this old man again. Carl appeared like a ghost 817 about 50 meters in front of Uchiha Madara. You don't seem surprised at all. Aren't you surprised to see eyes that exist only in mythology like the Sage of Six Paths? Although Uchiha Madara suffered a battle with Carl just now, the ninjas around were shocked when they saw him show Rinnegan, as if seeing Sage of Six Paths. Only Carl, from the beginning to the end, looked as calm as an ancient well, and there was not much surprise at all. Why be surprised? The appearance of Rinnegan can only prove one thing to the old man. Carl raised a finger while talking. What's up? Uchiha Madara frowned slightly. The three major pupil techniques can only be succumbed to the old man's fist. So is the Sharingan, so is the White Eye, and so is the Rinnegan. Carl shrugged and said with a smile. Ha ha ha, you don't think that the pupil technique I cast just now is the real power of Rinnegan, do you? This is the real fairy eye. What do you guys think of Rinnegan? Hearing this, Uchiha Madara was not only not angry, but laughed wildly. Carl, you are truly amazing. Even Hashirama can't keep up with my Madara's footsteps, but you have been keeping up, no slower than me, and the most important thing is that you still don't have a little bit of fairy blood, just a mere mortal, but you have the talents of a fairy. In all the people I have met, there is no one better than you, no one is stronger than you, not even Hashirama. As far as mortals are concerned, I, Uchiha Madara, would like to call you the strongest, but, mortals are just mortals after all, no matter how good you are, no matter how powerful you are, there is a limit that you cannot cross in your whole life. He stared at Carl, his maniacal laughter becoming watery. If the boundary you mentioned really exists, the old man will blow it to pieces with one punch. Carl's face didn't fluctuate at all, and he wasn't moved by Uchiha Madara's words at all. Then you try to smash the insurmountable boundary between you and me. Carl, next time I show the true power of the fairy eye, don't you, BFFJ, have any chance to touch my body, no, it's the collar. I said it. Uchiha Madara looked up to the sky and laughed wildly, and Rinnegan burst into a horrifying purple light, which made people avoid it subconsciously, and dared not look at it at all. As the purple light flickered, the astonishing Kamui-like pupil power burst out from his pair of Rinnegans. Looking at the entire basin, the atmosphere suddenly became extremely oppressive, and that suffocating sense of oppression filled the surroundings. Boom. When this oppressive feeling climbed up to ultimate, Chakra rose into the sky like a blue beam of light. A statue of Konoha Shinobi with a height of hundreds of meters, even if it is several kilometers away. The allied forces of the four villages can see it clearly. This Chakra Titan showed a huge body that stood upright when it first appeared, then put on a cloak, stretched out its hands, and finally revealed Haki's ferocious face. Broken blue armor. In an instant, a statue worthy of the power of a god, a Buddha statue that can trample all living beings in the entire ninja world, and a Uchiha god of destruction who overlooks everything. Suzano stands up completely, if it is impossible the mountains of Chaoyu stand majestically in the forest of leaves. Good, so big, as this really Suzano, so much more than Uchiha Shisui's Suzano. Near the valley of the end, tens of thousands of ninjas looked up at Suzano in shock without exception. Although separated by a long distance, they can still tell how huge the blue Suzano is. Even though they had seen the inhuman battle between Carl and Uchiha Madara just now, they were still pale with shock when they saw the full body of Suzano. Especially after seeing Orochimaru and Tsunade of Uchiha Shisui Suzano, they were even more shocked after silently comparing Uchiha Madara with Uchiha Shisui Suzano. Is this the real attitude of Suzano? Uchiha Fugaku opened his mouth wide in surprise, and looked at the perfect body Suzano who was like a Buddha and a god with a moved face. At this moment, he just understood why the records of Suzano in Uchiha history are almost full of praise. Chapter 178 Iron Fist was repulsed. Please subscribe to the sixth update. It's no wonder Iron Fist's evaluation of me was okay, not bad. Uchiha Shisui clenched his fists. Before, when he was in the land of water, he still felt that Carl looked down on him. But now, after witnessing Uchiha Madara's full-body Suzano, he just suddenly realized. It's not that Carl looks down on him, but his own Suzano, his own Mangekyo Sharingan is really only okay, not bad at this level of evaluation. A man who was used to seeing the eternal Mangekyo Sharingan, a man who was used to seeing the full-body Suzano and defeated him, when facing his Mangekyo Sharingan and the mature body Suzano, he really can only look good. At least, that's what he thought after seeing Uchiha Madara's full-body Suzano himself. How did Grandpa beat Uchiha Madara in the first place? Tsunade stood on top of Carl's stone statue, looking at the blue Suzano, which was bigger than the valley of the end, from a distance, her beautiful eyes were slightly lost. I see, Uchiha Madara didn't see me here at all. Onoki suddenly smiled bitterly. Before that, he once thought that Uchiha Madara was afraid of first Tsuchikage Shihei, and because of second Tsuchikage's lack of strength, he finally let them leave. But after seeing Suzano, who was even more majestic than this mountain, he finally understood that it was because Uchiha Madara didn't pay attention to him from the beginning to the end, so naturally he didn't care. The same is true for the original second Tsuchikage. This is just the eternal Mangekyo Sharingan, compared to the Uchiha Madara back then and the Rinnegan. Citrus Yagura, Third Rakage, and Yi Kang looked at each other, and they all saw the thick haze in each other's eyes. 
Gather the eternal Mangekyo Sharingan of the Uchiha clan, and the Rinnegan of the Sage of Six Paths, who cannot imagine how powerful Uchiha Madara is in his full glory. Perfect Suzano. It seems to be a little different from before. In addition to being a little bigger than before, the breath is also different. Carl glanced up at Suzano who was close at hand. Except for nine tails, all other tailed beasts are a head shorter than Uchiha Madara's full body Suzano at this time. Although it is said that the size of tailed beasts can be changed at will and can become bigger, the problem is that except for nine tails, other tailed beasts will not become stronger even if they become larger in size. Because the size does not match chakra, it affects the display of strength. Your observation hockey is as sharp as ever. Originally, I thought that you had to hit me with a blow, and you would only notice it after eating it. I didn't expect you to notice it just after I showed my full body, Suzano. Uchiha Madara stood at the crystal between Suzano's eyebrows, looking down at Carl. Since I opened Rinnegan, I found that Eternal Mangekyo Sharingan's pupil power is stronger than before, and all pupil techniques are more powerful than when I was fighting with you and Hashirama. We have to go to the next level. Naturally including Suzano. As for how much stronger it is, it can only be told by you yourself. After all, this is also the first time after I opened Rinnegan, in the state of Rinnegan, I opened a Suzano that surpassed the past perfect body. After finishing speaking, in a moment of Uchiha Madara's thought, Suzano, who is taller than the tailed beast and has more than one head, has a full body. After an absence of an era, he once again showed his godlike power today. Clang. I saw Suzano raised her hand and pulled out a long blue chakra knife from her waist that was comparable to a mountain peak. With just one action of drawing a sword, a typhoon like a natural disaster has been triggered in a thousand meter radius. Tens of thousands of ninjas in the distance looked over and found that the airflow showed ripples like water. Ask for flowers. Click. In the next second, Suzano, holding the chakra long knife, simply slashed with one hand, and the loud noise was louder than the roar of thunder, turning into an overwhelming sound wave that swept across the entire basin. At the same time, the basin with a radius of more than one kilometer was split into two halves by a bottomless, canyon-like crack on the spot like a cut watermelon. Obviously, the chakra-long knife in Suzano's hand didn't really cut on the basin, but this movement of swinging the knife triggered a terrifying destructive force that cut off the ground. Amidst the smoke and dust covering the sky and the air waves covering the earth, a figure suddenly flew out. It's Master Carl. He, he was knocked into the air. It's the first time I've seen someone knock back Vice Admiral Carl in battle. The ninjas on both sides who had been paying attention to the situation of the battle suddenly found that Carl flew a hundred meters away after Suzano swung his knife. Everyone who noticed it showed a dumbfounded expression without exception. Why are you panicking? Didn't you see that Uncle Carl didn't even have his clothes torn? No rolling eyes, no sharingan, just ask the people of Uchiha and Hyuga. Really, I didn't even look at the situation and just yelled there. Quote. Seeing that the morale of many Konoha Shinobi players in the Valley of the End was affected, Uzumaki Kashina couldn't help cursing angrily. After being scolded by her, Konoha Shinobi, who was a little panicked, calmed down a lot. Especially after they opened their white eyes, Hayuga of Sharingan, and Ninja of Uchiha told the story that although Carl flew out of the basin, but he was not injured, their hanging hearts were relieved. Chapter 179 Reincarnation Suzuo Madara, this old man recognizes you. The first update asks for subscription. Don't be so nervous, Konoha boys. Uchiha Madara's Rinnegan is indeed powerful. Even I really don't know how powerful that kind of fairy's eyes are if they are used to the limit. But there is one thing I can tell you with certainty, that Iron Fist hasn't really done it yet. As soon as Immortal Shima said this, the Konoha Shinobi fans who were shrouded in haze because of Uchiha Madara showing Rinnegan, breathed a sigh of relief. Haven't made a real move yet. Some Konoha Shinobi who only relied on information to understand Carl's strength were stunned when they heard the words of Shima Immortal. The non-human battle just now was called unrealistic. So, 747, is really serious. That man went to Mount Myoboku alone and fought with the old man back then. Immortal Shen Zuo suddenly sighed. Master Carl fought the Great Toad Sage. Jiraiya and Namikaze Minato asked immediately after hearing this. They have all been to Mount Myoboku, and they have all seen Great Toad Sage, especially after learning Sage Mode, they all feel the unfathomable chakra from Great Toad Sage very clearly. It's even scarier than a tailed beast. Have played a game. When Fukusaku Sage said this, he didn't know if he remembered something or had some concerns, so he never mentioned the battle between Carl and the Great Toad Sage on the spot. Seeing this, Jiraiya and Namikaze were curious, but they didn't dare to ask. Carl uncle hasn't even taken off his coat. Just as everyone was thinking about the wonderful battle between Carl and the strongest toad on Mount Myoboku, Tsunade's voice suddenly came from above the stone statue. All the Konoha shinobi who have been to the battlefield of water country and witnessed the battle between Carl and White Lotus, such as Orochimaru, Uzumaki Kashina, Hayuga Hiyashi, Uchiha Fugaku, etc., all had their pupils constricted when they heard this. At the beginning, F4, Jiraiya, and Namikaze Minato didn't quite understand what Tsunade meant, but soon as they turned their attention to the battlefield again, those ninjas who have never seen Carl and Balian fight without exception all were horrified. Even Saiyang and others, who had seen Uchiha Madara's fierce power and had full confidence in him, were the same. Rinnegan Suzano, Madara, this old man recognizes you. It seems that we have disappeared in an era, and you have not fallen too far behind, at least you are qualified to continue writing about old age. Carl, 
who flew upside down from the deep pit, stepped on the air with both feet before he landed. With his amazing foot strength, the air seemed to be compressed into a tangible and qualitative ladder. With a bang, he not only removed the impact caused by Suzano's swinging knife, but also went straight up into the void for hundreds of meters, directly leveling with Uchiha Madara, who was standing between Suzano's eyebrows and standing at a height of 100 meters. As this guy going to get serious? When Uchiha Madara saw Carl flashing to be level with him, when he reached out to unbutton the jacket, there was a circle of waves, and Rinnegan, who was always exuding a strong oppressive force, couldn't help showing a little dignified. During the Sengoku era, he fought Carl a lot. Naturally, he knew that from just now to now, the man in front of him was not serious. The best proof is that the black suit has never left the opponent. But what if you're serious? Rinnegan, and the power of the first generation three shadows. Plus the power of eternal Mangekio Sharingan and Hashirama. In the face of the power I have now, you have no chance of winning in the future. Uchiha Madara's eyes flashed with pride. Ready, Madara. After Carl took off his coat, he threw it away. The suit shot towards the valley of the end like a cannonball and fell into Tsunade's hands. Uchiha Madara said coldly without showing any weakness. Dare to say such things to the old man, should I say you are arrogant or ignorant? Fortunately, it was Rinnegan who allowed him to see these trajectories clearly and react in time. Or maybe it's the Rinnegan who endowed you with such defiant courage. Using his fists as the starting point, the black armament hockey surged out like a tide, sweeping the whole body in an instant. I should be asking if you are mentally prepared for the first defeat in your life. This time, it is no longer hardened fists, nor hardened arms, but from head to toe, the whole body is hardened, wrapped, and covered by armament hockey. Chi Chi. Rinnegan of Uchiha Madara flinched. It also becomes more meaningful to defeat the current you. 1.7 The moment the voice fell, Carl had already disappeared in the sky. At the same time, the sky of the basin that was cut in two by Suzano blew up a raging violent wind. Even though he has been keeping a close eye on Carl, and now he is using Rinnegan with better insight than Eternal Mangekio Sharingan, he can only catch a trace of Carl's movement. Carl grinned and shook his raised right hand. But I'm not the Uchiha Madara I was back then. I don't know whether it's the influence of armament hockey covering his whole body, or Carl's real action. His voice is a little colder and thicker than before. This speed, is faster than of course. Call out. But no matter what it is, it's meaningless in front of the old man's fist. Chapter 180 Carl's Fist, Susan's Knife, A Collision Away from an Era Part 2 Please Subscribe. Carl. Facing the real Carl, Uchiha Madara didn't give in at all, and directly drove Suzano to slash forward. Madara. Looking at the chakra long knife crushing like a mountain, Carl gave a cold shout, and slammed his right fist hard on the long knife that was close at hand. Carl de Tekken and Susan's sword finally ushered in a new confrontation after a long absence for an era. Boom. The moment the fists and knives collided, streaks of black and blue lightning suddenly fell from the sky of the Konoha forest in all directions. The thick, continuous land of the land of fire began to vibrate violently. Under the crushing shock wave, vegetation, bamboo, rocks, rivers, and hills were all destroyed in an instant. It was just a fist-knife collision, and the terrain of several kilometers around was directly rewritten. The confronting Konoha and the 15th allied forces of the four villages had to retreat while using ninjutsu and enchantment to resist the blows caused by Karl and Uchiha Madara who were fighting fiercely in the distance. It is also because of the protection of defensive ninjutsu and barriers that all the ninjas on the battlefield also saw a scene that they will never forget in their lifetime. Karl's fist, Suzano's knife, just a collision, not only rewritten the terrain of several kilometers, even the sky, also ruptured. A crack that spanned thousands of meters and resembled the mouth of a giant beast split apart in the sky above their heads. The boundless clouds in the sky of the land of fire seemed to be affected by the rupture gap, and a large number of clouds and mist were continuously drawn into it. It looked as if Karl and Uchiha Madara had split the sky with a single blow, bringing in a monstrous monster that was devouring the ninja sky. The sky was actually split. These two monsters, where are their limits? It's just one hit. Looking at the endless crack in the sky, all the ninjas trembled involuntarily. Many people even have the idea of running as far as they can, and ignoring all ninja wars. The ninjas from Karigakar, those who had witnessed Karl's punch through the sky of the country of water, relived this scene again, and all of them felt congested in their chests, continued to rush, and slumped directly on the ground with trembling bodies. However, this kind of ugliness fell into the eyes of ninjas in other ninja villages, but it did not attract the slightest ridicule or sarcasm. Because the ninjas from other ninja villages are not much better than the people from Karigakar. Even Saing seemed to lose control of his feet, moving back step by step. It seems that the instinct of the body is forcing their four shadows to stay farther away. Nice knife. Carl firmly suppressed Suzano's knife with one fist, and never let the chakra long knife, which cuts everything, approach half a point forward. Your punches aren't bad either. Uchiha Madara responded without showing any weakness, but there were waves of turmoil in his heart. He originally thought that after activating Rinnegan, the boosted Suzano would definitely gain the upper hand when fighting Carl, but after the blow just now, he found a fact that he was unwilling to accept but had to accept. Even Suzano, who has surpassed the perfect body in the past, can't crush Carl's fist. Is it really just not bad? When Carl heard this, the smile on his face grew even wider. He didn't say much, but apart from the ferocious lightning bursting out from his fist, armament hockey, which looked like streamers and flames, was also ignited. Otherwise what do you think? 
Seeing this, Uchiha Madara didn't dare to be negligent, and quickly controlled Suzano to reach out and pull out the second chakra long knife, and then crossed the two swords and slashed angrily. Carl didn't finish his sentence, but just clenched his five fingers more tightly, and then rushed forward angrily. Boom. In the second confrontation, even though Suzano used his second hand and the second chakra long knife, combining the power of the two swords to fight Carl, but under the collision of Ultimate's power. Even though Suzano's feet were as deep as two Optimus Primes into the ground of the Konoha Forest, they were still suppressed by Carl's surging fist and retreated ten by one. Damn it! Uchiha Madara gnashed her teeth to control Suzano, tried her best to stabilize her body, but couldn't stop Suzano. Obviously, the difference in body size between the two sides was huge, but the huge Shu 290 Zonung was pushed back abruptly by Carl, who was taller than ordinary people and less than three meters tall. This is obviously not what Uchiha Madara wants to see, holding the shame of the past, wanting to show the power of God, crushing Carl in one go. Fist bone meteorite. Carl didn't care about Uchiha Madara's ugly face, and punched out again. Massive armament hockey poured out from the fist like a wave, covering the sky of the land of fire in an instant, and even Suzano, who was shining with blue light, seemed to be dyed black at this time. As the black waves dissipated, Suzano's body, which was bigger and more majestic than a mountain peak, actually soared into the air. Instead of flying, Carl punched his feet off the ground and flew upside down. Tempest kick. After blowing Suzano away with one punch, Carl didn't show any signs of stopping, and just swept across the air with his kick. Call out. With a sharp sound of piercing through the air, a slashing wave bigger than the chakra long knife held by Suzano crossed the void, chasing and slashing towards Suzano.